and three, two, one, go. Uh, hold on. <laughs> hold on. Wait, wait, wait. False start. False start. Welcome back, y'all, to episode number four of Final Fantasy Rebirth. Woo! Basically, let's discover all the grasslands. That's kind of what this episode's going to entail, is I'm going to be trying to clear the area of the grasslands as much as possible before we head down to our main mission, which is through the swamplands. So... We want to do a bunch of Chadley's assignments today, try to bolster our stats, get as many good gear, upgrade our weapons, fight people in Queen's blood. I want to go back through into Calm. Calm just became accessible again. Oh, cool. I was actually, we hadn't seen this. Oh, okay. Wait, we're going to come back to that in one second. But yeah, so that is where we're picking back up with. And I think what I had kind of decided last time was we were going to head north and just try to kind of swoop around and then open up a lot of this terrain, see the entire map. And then what I'd like us to do is fast travel back to calm, possibly at the end of this video, but we'll see how long it ends up taking us. So I did want to see this though. Bill's Ranch Tower done. So we're getting 10 points for each activation intel spot yeah phenomenal intel one coastal outlook that must be somewhere else oh that's um yeah the phenomenon is all the way up here oh we have to check that out i don't know if all of them are gonna have fights or anything and then we have chadley grasslands objectives mm, level 17 at level 17, the only one that he needs us to scan is... That looks like the rat. Okay. All right, let's hop to it. Oh, and now... Chocobos. Although I will say with the chocobo, it's just easier to... I know I see... Oh, wait. Oh! When you're on chocobo back, you can collect all of them at the same time. Bill? Bill, I'm... Aww... Let me guess. Y'all are fixing to finally cross the swamplands, right? Not quite yet. Yeah, that's the plan. While I was making a routine inspection of my signage, a group of fellas shambled on by, heading toward the bog. Looked like a funeral procession, what with their black robes. Black robes? Yes, indeed. Told them they'd need some chocobos black for robes. safe passage. But I ain't even sure they heard me. The rogue guys? I expect Midgard Sorm will make a meal out of those boys. But if y you do catch up yeah. with him first, try to convince him to swing by the ranch. <laughs> He's always trying to get more. I mean, I would do. He owns a ranch, especially with all the competitors out there. The moment you get on a chocobo, your world gets a hundred million times bigger. I believe that. I do. A friend of mine from way back runs a chocobo ranch out near Junon. Junon. If you find the time, pay him a visit. Sam? No, Junon wouldn't be that. No. The moment you get on a chocobo, your world gets Whee! a hundred million times bigger. <laughs> okay, hold on. What direction are we headed? We're headed the opposite way. Wait, now that I'm on chocobo back, I wonder if I can hop up here. So we need to go. Let's drop a pin. There we go. Okay, now we have our pin. And now we ride. Ride for Rohan. I love this. Nope, 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 nope. I'm assuming just like 16, if you get too close to enemies, it will automatically make you have to get off of your... Wah! Your chocobo. Look at everybody on chocobo back. Oh my gosh, red. Red, no. I... What is that? Stray chocobos. These tough little chicks will lead you to chocobo stops. Um, there is something so wrong and just, I'm so, <laughs> I don't want to think about it too hard. Who are you? It has an acorn for its butt. Uh, let me go grab these. Oh, it's leading us here. It took us to this stop. Well, thank you, dear sir. All right, let's dismount. Can we talk with him? Oh, he, oh, we can now put this up. Oh, look at him, look at him. <laughs> oh, I have to hold it, I didn't hold. It's like a, is it a baby chocobo? Do they just, does their whole head change when they get older? <laughs> look at 
look at that. It has an acorn butt. It's a sapling butt. This chocobo stop is now in working order. Obtained a golden plume for setting it back up. And I can interact with this guy. What? You can pet him. <laughs> that, you know how they say chicken noodle soup for the soul, is it? Uh, mini chocobo for the soul. I, just because we put it back up, I think we still, yeah, we still have to use a cushion. So, hi. <laughs> Wait, I think we saw, so I think we saw one of these in the image for the cushion. Let's see if he sleeps with us. I think we saw him sleep with us. I don't need to sleep, but whatever, it's a cushion. Yes, he passed out. <laughs> Look at him. And he wakes back up. Does he follow us wherever we go? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we'll hop back. Does he now just hang out at that stop? <laughs> nice. So I'm assuming they'll be around, kind of hanging near any of the stops that we need to lift back up. All right, so I have my bearings. That's the farm that we used to be at. Oh, get away, go away. We need to go this way. Everybody this way. Break into a sprint. Nothing quite like riding Chocobo by the ocean. Oh, more. This makes collecting so much easier. Whoa! Do we follow it? I bet we follow it. Hold on. Yeah, it wants us to follow it, I think. Uh, okay. It wants us to... Oh, I can't ride my chocobo up there. <laughs> I thought... <laughs> didn't we see a chocobo climbing the wall in the trailer or something? Yeah, it's going above. There must be some treasure. <laughs> I need to name my chocobo. Oh, I gotta think of a name. I'm not creative with names. Expedition encounter. Oh, that's why. Look at that. You've stumbled upon a life spring. Why don't you try scanning it? See what you uncover. Accessing the planet's figurative database should help us learn about the area. Okay. Life Springs. Surveying Life Springs grants the wisdom of the Life Spring, revealing new points of interest. Following a Spring Seeker Owl, wait, following, yeah, will lead you to a Life Spring, its natural habitat. Could that be a Life Stream? <gasps> Look at all of the rare items by it, too. Yeah, we've seen one of these. I know where another one is. <gasps> there, look at it. It's, it almost, it's red like a cardinal, but it's, it... It's like a owl. All right, goodbye. Let's scan it. Oh. 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 Nice. Ooh, I like that. Oh. Oh. I get... I... Oh, okay, best. I like that a lot, actually. Life spring analysis complete. Intel has been relayed to Chadley, and we got 10 points. Calm, a recent history. A new region Intel is now available. Surveying life springs allows you to decipher the knowledge of the life spring stream, revealing regional Intel. Press, then select Chadley, then region Intel to find out. <laughs> okay, Chadley. Confirmed. Data received. Life springs such as this can be discovered in every region. Their potential energy output is far too minuscule for Shinra to exploit. Right. But to us, they're fonts of intel. I encourage you to seek out more of these life springs. I'm sure. Well, we know where the other one is. I've said it like six times now. Oh, nice. We have... There's also combat assignments, combat simulator. Oh. Look at all of the combat simulators. Biological intel. Yeah, yeah. The summon the materia. <gasps> you can acquire two of the auto unique abilities. <gasps> okay. 
story time. The backstory that I've been looking for the whole time. This humble town serves as a transport hub for the grasslands, hence the distinctive Bailey built for the monitoring of commercial and private traffic. During the war with the Republic of Junon, Shinra saw fit to occupy Kham due to its stout fortifications and strategic value, and it has remained under com uh, company control ever since. It does feel a little bit more like a citadel. It's got the high ground. It, it is a great spot. I think the fortifications, even I think some people in the town talked about how the girl that built the walls for one of the blood, one of the mini games, she talked about that. She was like, nobody's getting through these walls, just like the Kham walls or something. As it lacks a reactor of its own, Calm is reliant on Midgard and its pipelines for a steady supply of Mako, which is stored in a large tank for regular, regulated use. This arrangement allows the residents to enjoy both modern conveniences and a healthy environment, a combination that has attracted many new residents of late. Ten years ago, a significant portion of the town was damaged, though Shinra quickly intervened and carried out a comprehensive reconstruction effort. Details regarding this incident, about the incident and the extent of the destruction are sparse. So hopefully we can find two more to complete the story. Yes! I love you! Okay, we shall call him. I have to really think about this. Hold on. Oh my gosh, the pack of chocobos. I love it. What shall we name? Hmm... It's so yellow. I've got to think of this. Yellow. Uh, it's given to Walt. No. I was thinking of flowers. Okay, let me not force it. I got to think about it. I mean, guys, I'm not that creative with names. My cat's name is Ginger. She's orange. <laughs> like, what? What do you want from me? Uh, let's go path up here. Up here next. Drop in. Exploration days are my favorite. Yellow. It is giving big bird energy a little bit. It is. Oh, we're back at Chocobo Ranch. Let's go up and over this way. Yellow. Yellow, yellow, yellow. What are yellow things that I love? Flowers, but I don't think Daffodil's really calling to me on her. Hmm. I don't know why sunny is coming to mind because they're as bright as sun. Sunshine? Ray? Ray? Rays? No. I don't want to do a human name. Like, I'm not... I don't like... No. I do feel like there's two different types of people. It's like people that name their animals after, like, human kind of names and then other ones that are, like... Like, mittens or scruffy and just like other random sort of cutesy names oh oh can you slide buddy Whee! we need to have we also need to look for where she wants us to find the side quest hmm oh I definitely want to head over there Fluffy, no. Feathers. <gasps> Is it too much of a mashup to call her Kazooie? Kazooie? No. Zoo, no. Wait, there's something right there. Looks like a mushroom. What in the world is that? That is a Moogle thing. Okay, wait, we're gonna stay the course. No. My chocobo is not as sassy as Kazooie. Kazooie is a sassy little bird. Hmm. Whee! <gasps> Whoa, baby! We found a baby. Take me. Take me to your bus stop. Hold on. Let's go over here. I can sprint. Can I not do a glide? I faintly remember you could glide and... No! You can do that when you're going down. You can do like a downward glide. But you can't jump and glide. Huh. Okay, dismount. 
Put up another sign. All these fast travel points. Fast traveling will help us be able to conquer more as we go through these areas, but I have such a hard time fast traveling in games. I really do. <laughs> yes. And we got another golden plume. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't have anything. I can't rest even if I wanted to. Oh, yes. Okay, so we're going up into the side. I wish you could jump and glide. Items over here. We might be able to craft something, too. Ooh. Enemies. We're in exploration mode. We're not doing enemies right now. That was really nice of them to... Wah! Okay, that, I think that's where we're headed. That was so nice of them to make it so you pick up all of them instead of having to walk over each individual one. Do you know how much of a pain in the butt that would have been? All right, I'm not, I'm not forgetting about the name. Mm. Let's see what happens when we go into combat. Won't take long. First strike. Whoa! You have to kind of dismount on the... All right, we're doing this. He's blocking a lot of that. Let's get a shift going. Let's do a ward shift on... Oh, no, the Chrono Aegis. Yes, if he charges me, he should slow down. Come on. Oh, he's completely slowing. Chronos are ridiculous. We'll do it on this one. Okay, let's go ahead and do a focus shot on him. Weapon ability mastered. Then do a... Oh, his charge is still done. I'll show you what I can do. I'll show you what I can do. Let's go ahead and master Chrono as well. Do another one. We leveled up. He's slowed. He's slowed. He should be slowed. Did I not cast a Chrono? Oh, I thought I casted a Chrono. It's your turn. My turn. Let's do a firebolt again. Let's do this. Is that it? And now we leveled up, so we should be able to. I gotta save up and pray. I need to use her prayer as much as possible. That's right. My brain. Uh, this was how it was in the first part as well. My brain just. I want to focus on one task at a time. I'm very much like a lot of people think I'm good at multitasking. I don't think I am. I like just doing one thing, whatever's right in front of me. So if I say that like, okay, we're going to upgrade prey, I'm going to solely focus on upgrading prey. Alert. Voracious and venomous. Alert. Dangerous being detected in your vicinity. Please ensure you are prepared before engaging. <laughs> My sensors are picking up some understandable confusion. It's a pleasure to meet you, Cloud. Who is I am your personal monster assessment instrument. My? But since that's a mouthful, you can call me my. Chadley programmed me to assist you by providing detailed analyses of Chadley. the things you encounter. I hope I can be of service to you in the many battles ahead. Why am I not surprised? By the way, I'm picking up unusual fiend activity nearby. To procure the biological data that we require, you'll need to complete specific objectives during combat. But don't yeah. worry. Because I'll be here to help you succeed. Good luck. Okay, so Chadley would make a replica of himself, but in female form. I like <laughs> to fiends that Chadley wishes to analyze can be found in various locations throughout the world. Defeating these unique beasts and fulfilling certain battle objectives will unlock new trials. You cannot flee from these battles. Okay, so pressure. The pressure stagger avoid being poisoned is so effective at driving away predators that their population has exploded this particular variant is extremely dangerous capable of spitting toxic fluids on its prey before attacking in mass such tactics oh. allow them to hunt creatures as large as alpha ducks really Imagine something like that creeping into every corner it can yeah. find and you'll understand why taking down alpha ducks with any luck the data we collect here will aid us in finding a way to reduce their numbers. Rodents of unusual size. Wait. Scan him, scan him, scan him. Scan him. Okay, we gotta keep him pressured. I think we're gonna end up, like, smacking them. Oh, ow. No, I, d I missed avoid getting poisoned. Hold on. 
Keep it together. About damn time. Stagger him. Build up that stagger. She's getting wrecked back there. Aerith's getting wrecked. Aerith is getting wrecked. I'm gonna have to do it over again anyway. However I can help. Got him. We are not gonna successfully stagger this. Okay, let me cast a prey. I'll take care of you. He's not gonna get staggered. I gotta do something else to stagger. Soul Dream? I didn't do any of that. Any of the objectives. Yes, try again, try again, try again. That's a little bit difficult to avoid being poisoned. Retry. Oh, I like that you can retry right away. Okay, so pressure the enemy. It's a venerat. Switch over to a cloud. Keep the pressure up. Build that up, build that up. Let's do braver. Oh, I'm not gonna get the stagger on him. I gotta avoid getting, oh. Stagger him. Oh, come on. I gotta just keep slashing, but he's not gonna get staggered. He's gonna die. Don't overdo it. Yes, it's my turn. That kind of builds it up decently. And we've avoided being poisoned. We just have to pressure and stagger. He's gonna die. No, he's gonna get staggered. Nice. But I didn't pressure him. Well, that was glorious. I can't give you full marks. Objectives yet remain. Those are going to be a pain in the butt, and we're probably going to come back for later. Pressure. Under pressure. Manual. Mm. Battles. Pressure and stagger. Okay. Inflicting enough damage to exploit an elemental is the pressured state, right? We know pressured. Staggering. Certain abilities such as Cloud's Focus Thrust, Barret's Focus Shot, and Tifa's Focus Strife quickly fill the stagger gauge, especially when used on a pressured foe. Then staggering, filling the stagger gauge will immobilize your foe momentarily, leaving them defenseless and more susceptible to damage. Okay. Pressured is just using any of those, I think. So let's try it one more time. I think I'm gonna stick as Cloud. Barret was actually, once we have one rat, we can pressure. Oh, all I have to do is focus Rare on pressuring them. Huge, okay. The devs care about us. They care about us. Look at that. Not that that was ever in question, but Commencing you don't have to do all three of them at the same time. As long as you complete any of them, you can keep retrying and just knocking them off. That is really kind. The punch and odor that these speeds release when threatened is so mm -hmm. effective at driving away threats. First strike. <laughs> Switch to Cloud. You can do cloud it. is the only one that should be able to do this. Okay, focus thrust. Focus thrust. I'm not keeping him pressured. I feel like he's staying pressured. No, just staggered. Pressured. Okay, so I got staggered and pressured wrong then. I still have it wrong. Yeah. Failed. Pressured. So what I'm talking about, I feel like I read it and then I don't... Pressure and stagger. Pressured. Inflicting enough damage or exploiting an elemental weakness will put it in a pressured state. Elemental weakness. Let's do it. I missed the... Uh, I skipped past because I thought it was staggered, I guess. I must have. Okay, one more throw. Fourth time's a turn. Rare Toxerat variant identified. Let me scan it real quick. The Do, do. Do, do, do. Yes, I got it. I need to scan it. A Venerat? So I, don't I thought we had. 
This particular variant is extremely dangerous. <laughs> Allow me. No snow flurry. Frozen rare Toxorak variant. It's extremely aggressive in nature and overwhelmingly potent. We can steal beast talons with um with Aerith. Okay, let's do oops. Let's do with a snow flurry. Okay, we pressured him. We're good. I'm gonna try to get a prey off during this fight. Oh my gosh, I've been getting smacked. Triple slash him. After you. Okay, us versus this Venerat that's kicking my butt. This one's for you. Okay, cast a prey. Okay. Nice. Just keep building that up. We want prayer to be able to almost give us a full heal. I might be able to get one more. Aw, oh, no. All objectives completed. We recruit a lot of great data. Thanks to you. Our field manual is extremely like saving my butt. I don't even know. I don't know where I was going with that. Uh call chocobo. So what do I get? Is that it? I just I got points for it. It allows you to retry even though you've done it all. Is it a commands menu? Why am I in a stuck state? Do I need to do them all? No, I think that's good. So let me see. Fiend. No, I think it's good. I think we did. We're fine. I think we're fine. Phenomenon. All right, let's go see what a phenomenon is. Would it still show orange if we hadn't completed it then? Maybe you do have to do them all three at the same time, but I don't think so. Um, combat assignments? One, one done. Yeah, I think we're fine. Okay. What's coming to... Oi! Come here. What do we want to call her? Sunny? No. I know I said that before. There we go, got the chunk of ore. So now we are headed this way. We gotta go beyond the rocks and then around the side. Daisy, daffodil, daffy? No, that makes me think of daffy the duck. No. Daffy. Fable? Oh, is that the phenomenon? Oh, are we back at Chocobo Ranch? We're back at the ranch, but that's okay. I think we do have to hook around. How did I get back here already? I think we need to hook around this way. I need to start fast traveling. Come on. Mm. Yellow. It's gotta be something close to my heart. I love yellow, like yellow makes me happy. It's like the happy color of sunshine and rays and... <sighs> school buses, ew, I don't wanna think about a school bus with yellow though. She does get us from point A to B though, do be a school bus. Uh, Moogle's down here, but we wanna work around, but we might as well go see it, cause we're already here. Oh, I don't, okay. It doesn't always let you, yeah. I know, I'm trying to- well, I was thinking you could glide down, bubs. Are we just gonna call her Bubby? <laughs> I normally- that's just like my go-to term of endearment, Bubby. Hmm, I didn't have to name mine in 16. 16 was already named. Wait, isn't mine Pico? Mine is Pico. Why have I been trying- I'm over here trying to rename my- me just trying to rename him. His name's Pico. Pico. Pop inside a mushroom-shaped mog stool to get a peek at the lives of the fantastical creatures. Is that a mushroom? A real Moogle. Real Moogles. Mog. <laughs> Alright, I'm popping off. How could I forget Pico de Gallo? Let me pick up the stuff. 
Wait! Oh. All right. Peek inside. <laughs> Another the? world? Or is our girl? The rest of our crew is gone. Welcome <gasps> to our Moogle Emporium. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry to say we aren't open quite yet, and I'm not even sure when we will be. Oh. Kubo! Those Mooglets are refusing to come back, and we can't do business without them, Kubo. Actually, maybe you wouldn't mind helping? <laughs> the Mooglets are having too much fun to come back on their own, so I want you to round them up. And then we can open up the Emporium, and everyone will be happy, Kubo! I feel like I just entered a fever dream or something. Uh, <laughs> fine. I'll see what I can do. Assist the it's Moogle Merchant. Much, this takes Moogles to a whole nother level. Chase the Mooglets around and the field to lure them back to the Mogstool. Or catch them and escort them yourself. Just beware, they're playful little tricks. Get hit three times and the game's over. Oh no. <laughs> I feel like I'm on a... I don't even... It's like one of the maps from Super Smash Bros. Is that a house? Is that a house? What is it? Take him back to the middle. Whoa, trying to launch stuff. All right, here, we gotta take him to the middle. He's close, he's close, he's close. There, one, one. Oh! They remind me of uh, Jinjos. It's like finding the Banjo Kazooie Jinjos. Two. The different colors. Molulu. Molulu? Get in there. Get in there. And then Moog. Moog is launching bombs. Moog. Feisty. No, don't you dare. Get in there. Get in there. What's this one doing? Moki? Moki, you look mischievous. Yeah, bananas. Okay, Mario Kart now? God, I, oh wait, get in there. Mischief one complete. You're a lifesaver, Koopo. <laughs> this might be my favorite part so far. <laughs> what do we get? Points, Thanks I suppose. So much, oh, now the merchant should be open. open the Emporium. Yes. We can exchange Moogle medals for cool stuff we found lying around. Everything's great. It's I the promise. Mama Moogle. They look different. I will say the Moogles look different than I feel like I ever saw them in... They look very different. <laughs> I always think of the pom bomb from the DLC. Returning all the Mooglets to their Mog stool will grant access to new shop at which you can exchange Moogle medals for a variety of enticing items. Helping open more emporiums will increase the Moogles merchant rank, which will in turn expand their selection. It looks like they sell upgrades. Uh, the pink screen. Six Moogle medals already. Rubies. Rarity. I've picked up a bunch of these before. HP up. Allows use of the highest level of HP up materia. Increases maximum HP by 30%. That could be pretty good. Artisaur play. Yes, let's do both of these, but I can only buy one, so let's do clouds. Art of sword play. Absolutely. Confirm. Six MMs, Moogle medals. <laughs> All products. No returns? Just so you know, there are six more mock stools out there, Koopo. So be sure to say hi to my friends if you find one. I wonder also, if they... The more emporiums we open up, the more stuff we'll have for you to buy. That's a win-win situation <laughs> in my books, Koopo. This intelligence aid, Moogle Intel Prairie <laughs> Moogle. This is a side quester's dream, this game. Whoa, here we go. 
I was wondering how I was supposed to grab that. Okay, there's the story. Quest, flower on the hill. Head to this. But I can't see where that is on the map. 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 Wait. Go back to this. Quest, flowers on the hill. Zoom out. Oh my goodness. That's on the other side of calm. This girl's crazy. Wanted me to go grab... Oh, okay. I'll do it for her. You know I'm already on it. Uh, it is for Chloe. I was right. It was Chloe. Right. Okay, let's... Um. Oh, there's a thing here. Jade... Oh, let's go back here. We can collect the things about that. Oh, I see them. Each of these probably houses a... Jade Windhill Cash. Dismount. R1 is dismount, even though that's what we used to call, just doesn't feel instinctual to me yet. Mixed potion. Hmm. <laughs> there's gotta be another one here. It's probably one per windmill. Well, there's one back there too, though. What do we got here? There it is. I like how it's not overrun with creatures. I think if you were having to dodge all of these different creatures constantly, it would start making you a little just winded. That was something with, I think, 16. 16. Let me start by saying I loved 16 story and everything. There's the only thing, and I even openly talked about this in my playthrough, the only thing that I felt winded by was the abundance of side missions that were thrown at us right after. Uh, right before the very end. They, like, end up kind of overwhelming you and just also... At that point, there comes a point in the story where you're like, okay, I'm ready to see the ending. And then when you see, like, 10 more missions on the docket, you're like... All right, let me get back in there. But overall, I loved a lot of elements about 16. I think they had a decent amount of enemies just throughout the lands, but it also could depend on where you are. The grasslands might just be somewhere that doesn't house a lot of... I think it's very possible that as we explore other areas, we'll find more congested um locations with just many more oh wait we can get to the very top of this have i been there no okay let's go top side mm. we'll go top side do the lookout this feels like such a wasted oh i'm not even at the highest peak hold on Whee! <laughs> Oh, I wish you could jump off of this and glide. That is like the only thing that I would like to see more with the with the chocobo. Chadley. Oh, the Venerat. Yes, 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 yes. The Venerat. It reminds me so much of that Pokemon. The swamps, the breakthroughs, the flowers. I was going to do something. Transmutation. Oh, we still can't make a high potion. 50 XP planet's favor it's so dang hard to find planet's favor but we can make two of these <gasps> and we can make this power wrist guards oh cool what does it require beast pelt and iron ore do these require iron ore but i'm gonna do it the power wrist guards are great i could put some more on me again uh we're still level five what does this one need <gasps> mithril yeah the mithril ore and then we can make the wood sprite armlet which is an intricately carved armlet blessed by the spirits of the forest. Increase in magic defense and magic, it appears. And I can make a copper. I still can. A bracer mass produced during the war. 11 and 11. That's actually the copper brace. Oh, we're so close. Sailors. Nice. I know I can craft these whenever we need more, but I haven't needed any yet. Right now, I want to prioritize only crafting things we have yet to gain the XP from. All right, hop to it. I'm surprised there's not a stop here soon. Oh, but we're going to see a bunch of new missions too because we're turning on this receiver. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. Back up, back up, back up. We need more rare materials. To be fair. 
Bubby, you can get down there. Oh, okay. All right, that's fine. All I see is a chocobo with a flame around it. Red chocobo. There we go. I have to hold down. Yeah, I have to remember to hold. Sounds like a train. It's like a train horn. Okay, let's grab the materials I just saw here. And we might want to, we don't want to continue down the coast until we turn this on. Ore. Mithril ore. I feel like we're going to find that later on in the swamps. Or the mines. The mines. Oh. Activation site, Eastern Seaboard. Okay, we need to keep, oh my gosh. Take him! Take him! Okay. I'm coming! I'm coming! He's beelining for me! Oh. Okay, let's go. Have we seen these? Grasslands Wolf? Fireball Blade? Am I maxed with Fireball Blade, by the way? So it's my turn? Aerith, so... Aerith's going down. I gotta heal her. I'm gonna have to heal her. I'm bound. Oh my gosh, we are not gonna survive any main missions if I keep doing this. Alright, he needs to go ahead and focus shot that guy. I know, I know, I know, Anna. you can cast a- I know you can cast a prey. I got this. Okay, she just did a group heal. Let's go ahead and do a... Let's do spell, cure, Aerith. I know. Not a good fight for me. I'll take care of them. It's your turn. Gosh. Why am I forgetting how to... There we go. <laughs> Let me just get back to how the heck do I block again? Is it holding? I thought it was holding X. Can't believe I have to look this up. Battles. <laughs> uh, gauging limit breaks. It probably isn't even in here. It's in basics, I bet. Mm. Magic attack. No. Controls. There it is. Block. Block, 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 block. Dash, move, control, reset. Open commands menu, confirm. Wield weapon. Hold on, in the field. We have a new thing for odd jobs, right? World intel. Life springs. Mog stools. Combat assignments. Combat simulator. Traveling the world. Ginger, no! Moogle Mischief is one of the mini games. Does that really count as a mini game? I guess so. Yeah, I mean, I know. By definition, it'd be a minigame, but I want board games. Board game minigames only. All right, we head to the top. I'm gonna have to practice it. Maybe, oh, maybe it's never about like... To practice again. No, we haven't turned it on. We have to find the, oh, it's on the middle floor. Excuse me? It's around the side. No. What am I scanning? Activated at the very top, right? But I don't see that activation thing. I see how to get down here. Oh my gosh, it's at the bottom. Hmm, <sighs> might be time to go to bed. We're gonna get so many new things in this area too. This should show us the whole south. That like cove part. <gasps> what is that? Only two, only two things. Intel's been relayed to Chadley as well. I love this like the little dots too for the progression. What is this? Divine Intel, <gasps> beeline for it. 
Mm-hmm. Divine Intel, let's go. Scoop. There's something so peaceful about these. Like these sections where you just get to go and mess around and complete areas. I find that these are sometimes a little bit more difficult for me to determine when I should do a little bit of main mission, all side missions. Because you guys know... Wait. Hey Cloud, do you notice any sparkling minerals nearby? Um... These are known as guide stones. Oh. Crystals that direct travelers to shrines yeah. to the divine. The stones emit light when they shatter, producing an illuminated path. If ever you're lost, Try smashing one. Following the light should lead you to a sanctuary set to honor the tutelary deity of a given region. A deity. The shrines contain untold divine knowledge, slumbering within massive crystals. I can use this knowledge to strengthen your summoning materia, so I encourage you to seek out said sanctuaries. Is this going to be difficult to do? If it houses a deity? Oh, no. Oh. I know. <laughs> You're excited. Uh, I want to change also. I think we're good now with our... So my combat settings, we're good with everybody. Everybody has max, except for Aerith. We still have to do a couple things, I think. Let me go. I'm going to switch parties to the... I like the Cloud, Aerith, and Tifa. Mm-hmm. Swap her out. Although, I don't know. Red has that amazing attack. Oh, Red is actually... Oh, yeah. Aerith, we're still upgrading. Mm -hmm. Follow it. Oh, we gotta go. I think we need to do it on. Grasslands are home to Titan sanctuaries. Oh In no! In the age of myths, when Titan rose from his subterranean Titan. prison, he created a massive earthquake. Thus, did a vast swath of land rise from the sea, becoming oh, yes. grasslands. We need to call. We should be able to go. We should be able to know exactly where to go. Yeah, we'll right through here. I am loving all the knowledge that they're dropping for us. Yeah, there's a cave. <laughs> oh. Sanctuaries. Sanctuaries contain the crystallized knowledge of summons, which will strengthen your summoning materia. The path to a sanctuary is lined with guide stones. Break one to release the light and lead you to the sanctuary. There's so many boxes. Destination reached. Are we sure we want to do this? Yeah. Okay. It should just strengthen this them, right? This is positively incredible, Cloud. I can't recall ever seeing a crystal of this caliber before. To think the secrets of the divine dwell within. I cannot wait to see what sort of intel our analysis will yield. You'll need to synchronize with the crystal before I can extract data on the deiform entity. I'm counting on you. Extract it? As in analyzing summon crystals? Examining a summon crystal will reveal its memory matrix. A series of points will appear in order, and you must memorize their positions and necessary timing. The points will then disappear, and you must make inputs at the correct time to replicate the matrix. If you succeed, you will weaken the summon in its combat trial, strengthening its corresponding materia. Attempt to analyze. X, X. Okay. Okay. Uh, two o'clock? I guess I'll say two. Two, four, six, eight. Two, four, six, eight. Go. Two, four, six, eight. Yeah, it's nice that they made them line up with a clock. Data on Titan successfully extracted. Woo! Okay, that's so easy. Also, when we go back to him, we have so much money. Also, party level increased to two. A now 
analysis complete. I managed to extract the necessary data from the crystal. This should allow me to strengthen your materia. This is just breathtaking. The music changed as well. Pico up. Oh, this is perfect. This takes us exactly where we need to head to. Then we'll fast travel back to this point and then we'll explore the southern side. And then I'd say we hightail it over to Calm. Maybe play some uh, Queen's Blood. I do need to find new people to play. Oh, this is going to be the tower that I kept seeing from afar. Sorry. Oh, that's a. Oh, I thought it was purple. I always think the purple is amethyst and it's not. It's like, I think it's the ginger root. Phenomenon. Coastal Cop. lookout. The proto relic should be somewhere in your vicinity. It may not be in plain sight, but I trust you'll be able to find it. The proto relic. Easy enough. Said it might not be in plain sight. We need to climb. I see the. Oh! Oh, all that, but I see the rope or the fire, fire thing. Okay, let's hop off. Fire pole. Oi. Pico. <laughs> I keep accidentally pressing forward. There was a way to get on. Hold on. It's not going to let me. So we have to go around to the side, which I saw over here. Oh, will weigh it. <laughs> yep, this here's something that we'll appreciate. Mm. <laughs> Hell yeah. Why does this remind me so much of the tunnel it. sections? Wait, what are we appreciating? Mm. When it, uh, are these those three people going. again? No, the three people from the sewers, but then also multiple times in FF7. Oh, not these guys again. Beck. Burke, Butch. Bert. What are you doing here? Who are you? I mean, we know who they are, but I want to ask the question. Oh, hell no. Don't you dare act like you've forgotten Beck's badasses. The Beck's badasses, yeah, that's what it is. Beat us to shit. We hadn't even done nothing. You big jerks. I like Butch You're and his green hair. For the destruction of our charitable organization. Oh, charitable. Oh, are we? News to me. <laughs> what are you doing here? I love how we're having a genuine conversation. Midgar isn't big enough for us. We're taking our operations worldwide. We've gone legit. We're in business now. LLC and all. They're a special kind of stupid. <laughs> if Shinra can take over the world with Mako, then all we gotta do is find our own treasures and then we'll be on top. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we're gonna appreciate all the things. We're gonna appreciate all the things. Aww, he was trying to explain appreciate value. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? I mean, I would too. And it looks like crap. But it's definitely pulsing with a ridiculous <laughs> amount of power. Once we flip it, we'll be swimming in lakes of gill. Hey, Cloud, isn't that... What? Wait, I missed it. Hold on. Wait, now where was it? Treasure? Well, to be oh, the thing that we need to get. It. Yeah, we're the only ones who can appreciate it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hand it over. Now. Ha! You really think that's enough to intimidate the likes? No, uh... <laughs> please, it's all your eyes. Just don't hurt us again. <laughs> Play dead. Play dead. dead. We need to rename them the Possum <laughs> Brothers. We're freaking out. Now listen here, numbnuts. I got a foolproof plan. Yeah. I call it... Use a decoy! Yeah! Oh, <laughs> decoy. Oh, decoy means so, who's the decoy? Oh. It's you, such Borderlands the... uh, ah. psycho vibes. Oh, <laughs> 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 Wait. Gentlemen, 
It has been an honor. Oh my it gosh. Meet back at the hideout. <laughs> okay. Now that's just me. Mm. Oh, Twister. I don't think I had that move before. Tagging out. I got this. Do not touch T Aerith or Tifa. Ooh. Okay, let's do a fireball. I think I'm done with fireball, so. Oh, he is messing. Unbridled strength, go. Oh, you know what I have to do? Hold on. Oh. Okay, I can't do anything yet. I think they changed their music a little bit. I'm coming. Their music sounds very different. Why don't you There's one more, right? Or two. Okay. Last guy. Bert. Bert, baby. Uh firebolt him. It should toss him up. Oh, he's going after Aaron. Going by a little strength. Twister. Uppercut. Boom. And then let's finish with a dive kick. Level up as well. We need to go to one of the machines. Yo, yo. My readings indicate the proto relic is on the move. Their music's different. Bandits beat us to it. We gotta go grab it. I see. Fortunately, I've already ascertained the proto relic's destination. Would you mind heading there? Fortunately. So it's a chase. Phenomenon Intel one complete wild bandit chase. <laughs> oh, I have to say, I think I would have been disappointed if they hadn't made it. So yeah, I, I'm very happy with that. Oh my god. Wait. Okay, yeah, they're all that um does he always go down like that? Super duper dead. Super duper dead. Uh it did show us where they went, right? I completely missed it. Oh yeah, it's all the way over here now. So we have to I think we have to chase it, right? Essentially we're chasing it. So we're gonna head, um, I'm actually gonna fast travel. We haven't seen this. Walker Chocobo? Why does it matter? Okay, we're here. Oh, as in like you can spawn. Okay, cool. So when you fast travel, you can say what you rather spawn on. That's awesome. And then a fiend. You know, I'm gonna do it, but I feel like this is gonna unlock places over here. But I'm going to sprint down for this. Mm. Do, 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 do. I don't know how they keep doing it. Like, knock out of the park songs that don't disrupt the gameplay. Add to it. Oh, bus stop! Hi! Yeah! Um... Solely, like, add to it and don't take the player out of the moment. Like, it only continues to add to the game. And considering how boppy and beady some of them are, I find that really impressive. Like, they're, they're definitely getting stuck in my head in a good way. I wonder if you find these, if you don't find one of these guys sitting there, you can't put it back up? Maybe you have to have him? Another golden plume. I like that we're kind of doing... I break for chocobos. I break for no one. I break for chocobos. I think... It's really special that we're kind of piecing some things back together in the world. Like just making some stuff a little bit better than when we found it. Head all the way down. Wrap around the coast. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Let's go full speed ahead. I forgot how fast you can go. Nothing. Whoa! Full speed off the edge. Mm, Ginger. You're not going to let up on this, are you? She says, I want in and I want in now. Fiend, fiend until. Fiends, huh? Been itching for a bite. Rare alpha dog oh, okay. Let's hop off. Protocol. 
the docile disposition of the alpha dump led to its widespread adoption as a beast of burden. Mm. Applications included agriculture, transportation, and even warfare. Transportation. Variants like these, however, were valued as a source of hides and tusks used for arts and crafts. Unfortunately, they are a notoriously difficult creature to raise in captivity. I'm and sure. were usurped by the now ubiquitous Chocobo. You sir. The only remaining wild alpha dumps can be found here in the grasslands. Most are aggressive, especially these ones, which is why we must study them thoroughly before they become a threat to both animals and humans. They sound borderline endangered, and I'm actually adding to that too. Let me let her in real quick. I'm not going to stop. Her. I know, but it's gonna be boring. I'm just playing a game. You gonna walk all over? I don't have any food for you. You don't have snacks. She wants snacks. I don't have snacks. I know. She just wants attention. She's been super needy lately. Ma'am. <laughs> she also, like most cats, doesn't like having a door put in her face. She's like, I must get in there. You tell me not to go in there, I'm gonna go in there. Okay, so pressure, we know what to do now, right? Stagger, we know what to do, defeat an enemy. So we just need to, this should be, I think I can one and done this. We're just gonna have to scan them because they're a rare breed. Come on, Don't hold that. Keep it up. Okay, we need to switch to Cloud. Whoa, ow. Oh, these are big boys. Okay, assess first. Oh, this is an, uh, an Ed Edmidunk. Edmidunk. A rare elephant dunk variant that bears a deep grudge towards humans after losing its family to overhunting. It's a bit complex here. <laughs> Consequently, it will lash out at any person it sees. Exploiting its elemental weakness will pressure it, but also cause it to see red, at which point it will strengthen its guard and begin counter attacking. As time passes, others nearby will need to begin with a rampage. Okay, so we need to focus on doing a... We have a minute left. So let's cast a fire. And get in there. Nice pressure. We got him pressure, we got him pressure, build that up. Go on bridal strength. And then let's do a spells blizzard on him too. Take down the same one. Let's do spells. We have arrow. Let's do chrono. Now that should slow him down a little bit. We need spells. Fire. Fire in the sky. Then I need to go with thrust. Burn. He should be almost pressured. A minute left. A minute left. Let's do focus thrust. Nice. Staggered. Hit him. Hit him. Hit him. Hit him. Unbridled strength. Do, 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 Omni strike. Boom. Done. Okay. Now so we need to focus turn. solely on it's that guy. Taking over. We need to do, we need to unleash, uh, fire, fire. Need a light. Come on. Keep him pressure. Keep him pressure. She can do spells. She can do blizzard. I'll show you. Can you take over? I'm sorry, Aerith. I'm going to keep you off of this just for now, Aerith. Uh, we have a synergy ability. Let's go. Synchro Chrono. I'm in. Oh, I should have done that when he was pressured. That would have done so much damage. So, we finally got to see how you do. Oh, and now it costs us zero you. MP. Your strength knows no bounds. There we go. Easy. Give him your all. And boom. Okay. Easy. completing our combat objective. Yeah. Though I suspect it wasn't much of a challenge. Now, now that I know the pressure and stagger moves to do, I don't think this will be too much of a challenge at all. The timing was scary, though. That was a very impressive battle just now. Well done. I loved the synergy. Based on the battle data you provided, I was able to generate a new Horror virtual on the range. Trial. Home oh, on the range. And I helped too. Feel free to try it whenever the move takes you. Go on. Okay. Go on. All right, we don't want to do that again. Nope. So now we have done that. I feel like we should just clear this, except I can't. Some of the stuff will be uncleared. We need to walk over to the Chocobo Intel. I need to just go here. I'm going to go on foot so that all of this clears, most of this clears. There'll be some patchy spots, but for the most part, I think we'll be fine. I'm just going to try to hug to here. Get out of this area. 
Oh, now you want to leave because you realized... Oh, is this a special spot, though? This might be a... No. It's a junkyard of some sorts. Barrels. But no... Oh, guys, guys, I'm trying to kick these. Hold on. A grenade? A grenade? That has to be from the war. Right? Finding a grenade like that? I don't think we've seen that anywhere else. I know, I'll let you out in one second. You asked to come in, and now we're... I'm in the middle of this. I'm tired. <laughs> Cats, am I right? It's always one... If you don't do what they want, they don't want to be around you. And when you do what they want, they don't want to be around you. Treasure hunting with chocobos. When an icon appears above your chocobo, buried treasure is nearby and waiting to be sniffed out by your feathered friend. Hold to sniff in the air and then R to face the scent. Okay, he's sniffing. Oh! Okay, wait, he lost the scent. Keep sniffing. Where is it, buddy? Sniff it? Wait a minute, I think it was back here then. It might be somewhere like right here? It's right there! A baby. <laughs> okay. So how do, do I have to scour? Uh, 1100 gil? That's amazing! Okay, hold on. <laughs> Just a little bit longer. We'll do the lunch. Uh, <laughs> she's such... Pets have such a good internal clock. Like, she knows it's almost lunchtime for her. Almost. She has an automatic feeder, so she has food, but she just... She likes me to watch her while she eats. It's so weird. I don't know. I swear, the older she gets, the weirder and more picky and peculiar she is. Things have to be on her terms more than a normal cat. I think this is right. I think this is good. I think we just might want to kind of swoop up here for a second. And then I don't want to deal with those, so let's go around here. Collect these. And then we'll come back down. Yeah, that's, that's good enough for me. And then we're going to hook around to the side and open up this other path we saw. And I know where one of the springs is, so I would say let's go grab both of those. Because they're kind of near each other. And then I think, wah! I think we'll be good for... I think we'll be ready for going back to calm. These have respawned, look. We got a ruby here. Kick him, kick him. Let's go. Yes. Oh, we're cut. Here goes. Let's get that prayer. That leprechaun is looking at us. Okay, we're gonna do a prayer. It's your turn. I got and lock on. She's trying to charge her, yeah. But she did get the prey off. She did get the prey off. Let's go, Firebolt Blade. Uppercut him, uppercut him. Unbridled strength. Mmm. I'm getting messed up by these. He's staggered. Focus him. He's weak. Take him out. Focus strike. Nice stagger. Let's go ability is dive kick. Just like that, okay? I'm not really exploiting their weaknesses unless I absolutely have to. Like elemental weaknesses, I guess. That's three towers. Wait, technically four if you consider the first one. Ding! That will show us into the swamps a little bit too. Yeah! That shows us actually a decent chunk of this, mostly in the swamp. Yeah, Swampland's Tower. Intel received. Swampland's Tower. So we are, yeah, mm, okay. 
Is that showing us where we found her originally? I think it is, yeah. Chocobo intel all rounders of the grassland. The spring that we're looking for is actually right up here. Or maybe it was right here. It's somewhere, wait, it's right there. I think that's it. I think that's it. And we're right by that world activation tower. So let's go grab those. Come on, Pico. Grab those and then I'm probably gonna take a quick break and we'll come back. I'm having, I'm doing like, <laughs> oh, he's must have, wait, oh, two things. Oh no, there's two things happening. Okay, wait, let her sniff first. There. Okay, that's a lot easier than I first thought. Wait, you're digging in the wrong spot, sorry. <laughs> An emerald, expert excavator, excavator. No, it's, oh no, expedition. You know, we're gonna hold off. I know that it is showing us where to go, but I'm gonna go towards, I know, I mean, but we'll come back. It will still be here. Oh wait, it wants to take us to a spring. The spring is that, right? Isn't that a spring? Okay. Mmm. Leave him alone, leave him alone. Where is this? Okay, fine, we'll do it, we'll do it, we'll do it, we'll do it. And then I might fast travel up to a closer spot. I'm trying, buddy, I'm trying. And then, this is gonna be a series of, I think, oh, this is like cyberpunk all over again. Me being like, all right, guys, this is what we're gonna do today, and this, this, and this, and then, not only do I not get everything done, I, oh, this is awesome. I always think I can do more than I actually end up doing. I also love the scanning part. I think at this point, I'm just gonna sound like a broken record because I love everything. There isn't anything I haven't thoroughly enjoyed. Three, four, three. We can buy all the materia. Speaking of materia, I'm glad you guys brought that up. Let's talk to Chadley first. Cloud, by analyzing the LifeSpring data, I was able to locate an old Republic transmitter chip. This chip likely contains an exceptionally rare formula. I recommend searching for it. S particularly rare formula? Bygone settlement. New excavation site. <gasps> awesome. This isn't even the LifeSpring that I was thinking about, though, guys. The LifeSpring I'm thinking about is still up there. Hmm. I bet you there's one in here. I bet this is one. It just is too convenient not to be. Like, if you look at this... It's gotta be. I think when we get near there, we'll find one. So, what? Baby? Baby? <laughs> so... <laughs> Materia. Specifically, this is what I want for T uh, Tifa. She has chakra, but we're gonna add, oh, and I need to add my fire and ice. I got those and then I ended the video and that's why I forgot about them. Unique auto, yes. So now Tifa will also use unbridled strength when not actively controlled if this materia is equipped. So good for her. And then cloud, I'm actually gonna go ahead and remove, actually I can add more. <gasps> I have extra as fire and ice, but I think that means I should remove fire. And let's put on, I don't have any additional ones. So I might as well keep fire on just so we level it up, just in case. Who are we left? Aerith, Aerith's new staff. Aerith's new staff we need to get. Oh, let me fast travel. Uh, go. There we go. Cloud, go. <laughs> Cloud, do this. All right, I'm gonna fast travel to do 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 do. This, hell yeah. Didn't give me the chocobo option though. Yeah, we have collected these before, so it must be timer reset. 
do 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 that makes sense the archaeological yep archaeological dig would be right here the bygone settlement yeah Whee! <laughs> area of interest hey cloud it seems that a transmitter chip is buried nearby you should be able to sniff it out with the aid of a chocobo once you pinpoint its location you can ask your bird to dig it up with that let the treasure hunt begin Excavating with chocobos. Controls. I think it's the same that we just saw. We need to unearth three artifacts. All right, baby. What you got? No scent? Let's go somewhere closer. Oh, wait, wait, wait. She's got a scent. She's got a scent. Scents this way. Okay. All right, let's go back up. Oh yeah, you caught wind of it. It's near here. There. You can now transmute an enhanced copper. I didn't even, th I, I saw the levels, but I didn't even think about, oh my goodness, I, I didn't even think about advanced weapons and crafts and items and, oh. I did not even think about that, no. Transmute a cushion! Oh, what do we need for a cushion? A cushion's only five? Sage? Guys, we will never have to buy another cushion again. Does it cost a little bit more every time? I own six cushions? Also, we are so close to level. Oh. I can craft these. Copper? Oh, because I have the first ones, and all I need is the titanium. Wait, it only gives me 5 XP. Level 6 craftsman, though. Revival earrings, power wrist guards we already have. Level for Fortress Bracer, a stout standard issue. 2020. Beguiling Amulet, 15. I don't know those. Yeah, well, we don't have access to them anyway. Here we go. Mist High Potion and an Ether now. <gasps> All right, one last artifact. Artifact? We should be good. Pick up the scent, baby. There it is. Sniff it out. Who needs a German Shepherd when you got a Chocobo? We're getting weird signals. It's right here. That means it's blocked by something. Sniff it. There it is. Didn't. Transmute a windmill gear? Is that to repair the windmills? We haven't seen that side mission, but that's probably one of our side missions. That's quite the transmuter chip you found. In fact, it was once used in the construction of windmills. Yeah. Given its rarity, I would not be surprised if someone had need of such technology. Yes, I believe I know exactly who. I think the girl that we saw by the windmill up at the farm. Excavation bygone. I think we could complete all the grasslands in one episode, possibly. Here's the thing, y'all. I think this is a spring still. I do. The thing is, you smell something. I, um... I... Uh, still this way? Okay, it's right around the corner. I think it's under the tree. Oh. Um... I'm trying really hard to... <laughs> Trying really hard not to make these videos super long. I know y'all would prefer kind of, I think like three, four hour videos. I just, there's not that much time to do, I think on each week. Usually if I do longer videos, it means that I am just barely keeping up with the output. However, I, I just keep getting carried away with this game. And then that was what happened. Well, the first video there, there, yes. I know there's a spring here. I do, I know there's a spring here. 
and it's just too easy to sink hours and hours and hours into this game especially with how open it is now and all the collectibles and all the side missions and things <sighs> i just know these are gonna be long videos so i hope you guys are ready <laughs> i hope i'm ready <laughs> but it doesn't even feel like a, i don't know how to describe this I'm, i guess other than just saying it doesn't feel like recording other than reminding myself to talk out loud <laughs> it's just effortless Boom. Ooh. This is the third. Aren't there three life springs in this whole area? Grass waste life spring. Oh, there's three more. Okay, flora and fauna of the grasslands. New region intel is now available. Analyzing the life spring. He doesn't want to talk to us? Mmm, we need to go into the menu. All right, story time, guys. Flora and fauna of the grasslands. In stark contrast to the barren, Mako-ravaged outskirts of Midgar, the ecosystem of the grasslands remains relatively unscathed. Streams flowing from the central mountain range nourish the lush meadows below, which sustain a diverse range of species. Ranchers and farmers also benefit greatly from this bountiful environment. Vast wetlands make up much of the southern region. In days past, boats and chocobo carriages were a common sight. But as most goods are now transported by sea or air, traffic through the wetlands has steadily decreased. Moreover, an immense man-eating serpent, dubbed Midgard Summer, I'm saying it was so wrong, I know. Midgard. Midnight summer, wait, midsummer, <laughs> midsummer night's dream has been sighted in this area of late. Few dare to brave the old trails, even those capable of evading the gargantuan. Oh, I messed up. Even those capable of evading the gargantuan snake may yet fall victim to one of the many inescapable quagmires. Oh. Okay, right. there is still much to do. I am just gonna activate this tower and then I'm gonna step away for a second. Maybe. I think I said that last time. <laughs> I can't stop. I can't put it down. I'm also trying to make use of like, I, I took like three days to just record as much as possible. So I'm trying to make use of every second of it so without my eyeballs falling off. This? Wait, Brown where? Variant identified. Commencing guidance protocol. It may look like nothing more than a wriggling plant, oh. but don't be fooled. Mandragora roots are- Wait, 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 stagger an enemy. Okay, I don't even know what we're doing. Uh, defeat them all within a time, don't let them fall asleep. Wait. I'll show you what I can do. Can you take over? Take it over. Don't let them fall asleep. Keep pressure on all of them. Keep pressure on all of them. Oh, we- Oh, one fell asleep. One fell asleep. This guy, this was the one that fell asleep. Preventing them from falling asleep is gonna be hard. Why don't you leave I got this. We go focus thrust. Deal with that. No, you're not taking a quick nap. We gotta somehow keep them together. I haven't been able to stagger one. Yeah. That was not good. You can clear all the objectives too. Prevent preventing one from napping might be kind of difficult. Prevent enemies from using quick nap, stagger enemy. All right, let's scan. We got to scan again because they're going to be a little bit different. We start by scanning. Also, I was on Chocobo back, so I feel like that kind of messed me up. I'm coming. It's your turn. Let's do this. Let's do this. Don't let them fall asleep. Mandrake is fire and ice, which we happen to know both. But I think I knew this one. Okay, defeat all enemies within the time was good. We want Blizzard on this guy. If I don't keep one, like, I gotta keep... Staggered, there we go. Nice. All right, so she's just taking out these two. We have to make sure that they fall, don't fall asleep. So we need to focus up on the same one. Don't let him fall asleep. Focus, Trig. 
Okay, hold on. Hit him with a blizzard. Deal with that. Call ice. That should kill him. Nice. Last one. All right, we just have to keep the pressure up. Let's go unbridled. Actually, if we're on, if we don't have unbridled on, she should use unbridled when I don't even ask for it to. Let's do a fire on the mantra. Easy. Woo. Another one bites the dust. And as I was, because I didn't even, we happened to run into that, though it's unintentional. All right, we need to get across this ravine or this little, not ravine, but. Mm -hmm. We need the planet's, not blessing, planet's prayer. A little swim. I guess we have to get the blood off. So you know. There's trolls and wolves. Oh, Tifa went down. My turn. All right, try to focus up on the same thing. All on the wolf. Go back to the wolf. He's doing a tailspin. Go focus thrust on this. All right, that creature staggered. Can you get over here. Nice. Nice. You know what I forgot to do though at the last one that we activated? I forgot to go up. Wait, not all of them are activated by the bottom. I forgot to go up top. So there might've been an item up there that I missed. Oh, the view. So the wetlands do count as part of the grasslands, I believe. Maybe I could be interpreting that wrong, but I think this whole area, activation Intel 4. Let's go to the top and then we're gonna look at our map. Oh, hi. Uh, this is me if I were in the game. That's me. <laughs> I love them. I just choke a bohu. They rem you know what they remind me of? Oh, the Mass Effect monkeys. What were they called? Oh, there were so many. I normally remember the name and this is what happens whenever I'm doing a recording or a stream. I instantly forget it. Pie Jacks, the Pie Jacks. All right, guys, look at this. We do want to go back to Chadley, but we have we have a lot of stuff complete. We'll need to go over and venture into this land, but all of that is untouched. But yeah, we have a massive chunk of this done. Does it show us? It doesn't show you how much explored compared to that, but that's okay. Mm. I think I'm gonna fast travel back to Chadley real quick. Okay, fast travel to Chocobo Ranch. Go talk to Chadley about all the stuff that we've just done for him. And then we'll head to come. Cloud. I have recreated Titan, the mythical oh, no. colossus of the grasslands in virtual space. I encourage you to pit your skills against this summoned entity so that I might complete its materia. But I'm I'm still so new. Let me develop. Auto Auto unique ability will be nice. I want to own a morph and I want to own an auto cast and assign those. And then I'm gonna save some of my other points from him. Oh, we have so many points. You know what? We should just have auto unique ability materia for all of our characters that we're, we're working with. Mm-hmm. Ask about world any intel. Any questions about world intel? Don't be shy now. Oh, I guess if you didn't ask these right away, you can always come back later, which is nice. That give, it gives you that option. All right, Chadley. If there's anything else I can do for you, please let me know. So going into Materia, Cloud, I want to look at this. I don't have any links. Oh, that's a bummer. Okay, so I do have something different. So right now I'm using Metal, which is eight uh, defense and eight magic. So we have better stuff for me. Yeah, we definitely have better stuff for me. 
Let's do the invisibility. I would say 14, 14. I would say four. I would say this one. I'd rather for Cloud have magic defense than magic. Um, even though I think his weapons proc off of that, or also just his spells, I believe too. Um, I want to double check that though, because I actually, I also am increasing my speed, but I don't, I think there's better things to have too. Mm. We have another wrist guard. I can put my wrist guards back on for my strength. Yeah, let me put my wrist guards back on. And then Tifa has power wrist guards, which is exactly what she should have. She has eight and eight. I do have something better for her. I have the enhanced copper. Let's do enhanced copper for her. Oh, and power. Yeah, no, 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 that's good. Aerith, Aerith, my love. All right, metal bracers. I need to sell some of these items too. I'm going to give her this one. I actually should give her this one more because yeah, I'm going to swap that with one another and her earrings are magic power. So she's good there. Tifa actually should have instead of the metal bracer, I want her to have this enhanced wood sprite armlet, which is slightly less than what Tifa or what Aerith has, but Aerith has the magic. She's much more magic heavy and she's a little weak too. So uh, we should definitely have as much strength and defense on her. Barrett has a leather bangle. That's good for him. I think he's fine. Bulletproof vest, great. Gatling gun is good to go. We probably just need to cast Aerith's wand one more time. Staff, I guess it wouldn't be a wand. Hmm. Mithril collar. He's got leather. Yeah, yeah. He's he's good there. As far as this, this is increase the spirit by five percent. Increase his speed. I'm gonna increase his speed, and then we're also gonna do this for him because he does have a link. Um. Where was it? Auto cast. Allows an ally to automatically use spells to the linked material when not actively controlled. I like that for him. And then we're going to put the fire material that I actually took off because I have fire and ice. So I'm going to leave that to him. And then I'm going to put morph allows you to turn your enemies. Yeah, I actually think I'm going to put more. Uh, there's two auto unique ability. No, I would do morph on him. And then let me go back to Aerith. I want to have her automatically cast when I'm not using her, if possible. Auto cast materia. Oh, no, 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 no. That's right. There's, it's called something different. Auto unique. Auto unique. Yeah. I'm happy with that. We still have more materia slots. So again, those are empty. I know that's probably I some of you guys might fill that right away. I'm kind of holding out on it. And then we can also buy at shops I'm always and happy to help. we need to upgrade real quick, too. There might be new sales. Let me see if there's any new sales going on. No, no sales. Let's upgrade. I'm, I'm postponing it. I'm coming back. I'm just I'm I was going to go grab lunch and I just don't want to stop. OK, so now at level 20, we just have unlocked more things we could not put into this yet. Counter fire. Team up with your partner in time. Synergy skill. Static shock. Increased punisher. Wind current. What are these? Weapon ability damage increases weapon ability damage by 3%. Increases damage dealt by basic attacks. So we eventually want to head over there. It's a question of do I want to go this route? Relentless rush. Cloud launches Tifa towards an enemy. Ooh. Mm, but this is with anybody. To unleash a counter strike. So he comes sweeping in, they release it and they launch it back. You know, I like Relentless Rush, but I think we already have something that's specifically... No, we have something... <gasps> oh, no, I have something that's just with Aerith. I feel like I need to even it out. Oh, no. No, whichever one I prefer. I do prefer the Relentless Rush, though. This is locked as of right now. Weapon level three. Wildfire. Unleash a my fire attack without expending. Okay, we're going to go Enhanced Attack. And then the next one we'll do is weapon ability. So heading over to Tifa. United refocus. 
increase his damage dealt by unique abilities by 5%. Let's go that way out with her. She has five more, but all of these cost 10 now, I think. Slip and slide. Team up with your partner to dodge and deliver a counter-strike. Why are they all just synergy-based? I guess they really want you to lean on synergy. ATB charge up rate. <gasps> we need to beeline for that. I'm gonna save up more SP with for her. We have 10 for Aerith. Combat savior. Ask your partner to temporarily follow up on attacks. No, you know what I want for her? Bodyguard. I want bodyguard. Yeah, that's been brutal with her. And then max MP up for her. Barret. Barret has 10 as well. Iron defense. Team up with your partner to take a strong defense stance. I like that. We need to start going defense. Increase HP for him. Avalanche two-step. Oh, we have to get that just for the novelty. And red. Red last. You guys are going to be like, you're not giving love, uh, red any love. Phantom Fang. It's kind of fun. What is this one? Oh, max HP, yeah. Let's go match max HP for him. Savage Assault. They're all 10, so I'm gonna hold off. So the two people that we're waiting for uh, five more SP on would be Tifa and Red, and then we can do another thing. Let's get a rest stop. Let's also rest and heal everybody. And then I'm gonna step away for a second and I will be back, but hold on, I'm just gonna open. I wanna see how much time we put in. HP and MP full. We're already 11 hours in. Oh no. Okay guys, I'm gonna go grab lunch and I will be back for more. Right, so we have so many things to do. Wait, I should have checked. Oh crap. I should have checked how long the last video was. I think it was over an hour. I think it was just shy of an hour. So we can do, we can do another hour or two or two. <laughs> I should have checked. Uh, right, let's go to calm. So let's actually fast travel because yeah, let's fast travel. I, I'm not ready to do Titan yet. I do love a good challenge. You guys know I do, but let's hop back to side hustle. But I need to fast travel somewhere else first. Can I set? Oh, Chadley's there too. Can I fast travel? Not to the rest spot, but I can travel here. There we go. <laughs> oh, can you go back in that way? Can I go around the front if I were to go this way? Would I be able to travel around and enter the city through here? I actually think we could. I'm gonna try that. I am gonna try that. But in order to do this, we need to fast travel to like here. Choke, I put walk, but chocobo. Okay. Dur -dur. Hey, Bobby. All right, let's get going. Yeah, this way we can explore some new territory as well. Look at the trees. Also, I want to make sure we're paying attention to as we get closer to this round side. Look at this. Look this at how. Seen better days. Yeah. Much of the Republic's infrastructure has fallen into disrepair after years of neglect. And you know damn well, Shinra ain't about to spend a mm -hmm. single gill on shit they don't use. No. Is it true the Republic used to run buses between towns? Yes, though that service ended when the war did. In other words, oh. we gotta hoof it, cause Shinra's run by tightwads. Well, I don't mind. It's kind of fun exploring the great outdoors. You do you. You do you. Okay, Red. <laughs> um, look at how the contrast. Like just what i don't i don't i was almost gonna say feet but a yard even still just you could throw a stone and pop over to the desolate area and then back to a more lush area i guess if this isn't even like if the grasslands aren't even the lushest of areas like that's what it looks like after a little bit think about what this entire world looked like when it was in its prime. Hmm. Okay, there is a tower along this path that- oh, oh, we could do- 
We are so close. We might as well. We're so close. The pipeline. I love how they made it so that at least like three people are kind of in this chat with you at all times. Oh, here we go. Encounter number two, y'all. Mm. Do you notice wow. that, oh. I've picked up readings from the proto relic. I believe the bandits are close by and busy preparing a meal, if I'm not mistaken. You can they smell that? They flee if openly confronted. I suggest using those shipping containers to cover your approach. Oh, we have to be stealthy? Make a stealth approach? Okay. Mm. I don't think I should go for that guy. I think I should go for the guy behind that shipping crate. But I wish I could. Okay, I can speed up a little bit. Be careful, be careful, be careful. Infiltrating the hideout. Take cover behind the shipping containers to reach the room undetected. Guys, I'm not a stealthy person. That's a lot more than they normally have. Beck's badasses. Oh, snap. <laughs> you did just like that, boss. Bert? Don't be an idiot. I had to for the treasure, obviously. I was inconsolable. Inconceivable. Damn, that smells good. Shoot. Oh, it's like when you're Shoot. Consolable, but Okay, he's going back. He's going back. Oh, I'm running on empty. This is good. You think that Mick's gonna come after us? Uh oh. Oh! Somebody there? Uh probably just okay. a critter. We'll hide out here till that Merc gives up. Oh no. Is he gonna see us in the corner over here? No. But I can't go that way. I've gotta go. Oh, I see it. Okay, I see the route. Okay, wait for this guy. Wait for him. I'm starving over here. We'll hide out here till that Merc gives up. Hey, boss. Can we eat yet? Okay, move, move, move. Alright, we've got the guy up there. This guy here. And then this guy here. Does he turn around? The guy upstairs is turned around. This guy's turned around. But he's gonna look and he's gonna see. Okay, that guy's turned around now too. That guy doesn't see us. All we have to worry about is... Oh! I gotta go, I gotta go. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No! No! My blade? Yes, it was nothing. Oh, 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 oh! oh. Oh, oh, snap, 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 snap. Yeah, go, go, go. Oh. Well. Hey, oh. <laughs> if that's not well done, I don't know what is. I like the change in music for them. And that split between all of those guys. <laughs> Who knew he was a culinary expert? Me, me, me. Find a way into the building. Okay. So now they've left. Find a way into the building. It's gotta be up here. Are we gonna have to be stealthy though? Yeah, okay, this is locked. The door is locked. We have to find another way. Okay, we can go up here. Oh, do you see what I see? Do you see what I see? Up here. Up. 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 But we're not going to be able to go through there, so let's go here. I'm trying to remember if we had anything that was super stealthy, like any hard stealth missions. Oh. Yeah. You want us to? Okay. 
Good morning. Oh. Yes, shut up and hand it over. Yeah, actually. Or do we say no, not really? Then why the hell are you chasing us? Reverse psychology? Really? You know, you could just tell us who you're working for, cut out the middleman, deal with them direct. I don't have time for this. Get them away right now, boss. Relax, boys. I've got just the plan. I call it bait in the hook. Bait in the hook. Oh, my gosh. Look at the bait. Wait. What's the bait? For all intensive purposes, it's you. <laughs> Me? Here, take this. Thanks. Can I eat it? <laughs> Tuck it for the getcha! Oh! Okay, yeah. Throw the meat at it. Butch beefed up? What? Easy. Butch beefed up? Whoa, whoa, he has a bird. I'm sorry, what? I, I'm sorry, what? I was sitting here thinking that the bird was going to eat him. Not the other way around. All right, we are. Butch, I was trying to get the bird. A member of Beck's badasses, he decapped, decamped, there we go. He decamped Midgar's Undercity simply because Beck told him to, and has yet to question why. His special skills are plain dead and speed eating, that's evident. Exploiting his elemental weakness will pressure him, attacking him while he's busy. We'll set a trap and stagger him instantly. Look at the bird right now, by the way. I love these freeze frames. Okay, bird's down. And Butch is down. Butch is down, baby. Butch. I'm coming. I'm coming. Reminds me of, uh... Oh, he always slumps like that. That was so worth it! <laughs> I don't think it really mattered whatever I said about wanting the relic. So, um, Cloud? Oh. The proto relic does not appear to be at your location. Whatever. You can track it, can't you? I most certainly can. Not only that, I deduced where the bandits are headed next. Oh no, it's gonna be somewhere. Note, I'll let you get back to it. Somewhere super far. Okay, we got ten more though. And phenomenon intel too. One badass barbecue. I liked the little stealth mission there. Okay, that's actually a great. That's great. Yeah, we could we could jet across to right here and then go up and over. I know I said we were going to come back and do calm, but I feel like exploring all of this area is kind of part of part of getting closer to that. Although actually, you know what? I'm going to do myself a favor. I'm going to fast travel here to calm. I'm going to avoid this, you know why? Because we can pick up side missions that might take us to these locations and then we can kill two birds, one stone. Is currently on high alert. High alert. <gasps> uh, there's no more people to play. Unless I replayed some of these people. I shouldn't have done them all the first day. Hello there. Hi. Inspiring, isn't it? The view. I'm Snaps, by the way. Snaps. Shutterbug and card-carrying member of the Association of Photography Aficionados. Mind if I get a shot of you? For posterity. Oh my, the pose! He's remembering his days with <laughs> Andrea. A picture. You got what it takes to be in front of the camera. <gasps> we got a picture! But what about behind it? So, apparently there's a rather scenic spot not far from here. A side mission of taking Thing pictures? Is, this terrain's a bit perilous. At least for your average photog like me, but maybe not for you. If you find the spot, take a moment to appreciate it. Try to view it as a professional photographer might. Easy enough. Grassland scenic spot. <gasps> a bunch more. Oh, just one. Oh, easy. Okay. Imposing. Oh, do I go into talking to him again? Share your scenic. Oh, no. No, I have nothing. 
If you find any other yeah, I... locations, let me know. I was gonna say, I bet he is something that keeps building off of it. Oh, shit. Sounds like more the inn. We should go back and. Wait, who? Broden not doing so well. Didn't you used to have a crush on him? Said his eyes looked sad when he smiled or something. Oh. Don't tell my husband. Broden, we need to check on Broden, guys. Wait. Breaking news at this hour. Avalanche, the anti Shinra terrorist group mm. responsible for the bombings in Midgar. Oh, there he is. To have taken shelter, shelter and calm. calm. Security forces performed a thorough sweep of the town, during which time it was placed under a temporary lockdown, which has since been lifted as of this report. Nice. The suspects remain at large, though public security is confident they will be apprehended soon. Local insurgents are believed to have played a role in their escape. <sighs> The company will conduct a separate investigation to identify these collaborators. You know what that means. Residents with any information to step forward. They might be sending Turks, possibly. To arrest is subject to a reward. I don't know. I could see them sending Turks. Hello. Welcome to the inn at Calm. Oh, we can. OK, we're not going to rest yet, but Broden, he's going to be like, what the hell are you doing back here? Oh, you're back. I guess that means you managed to shake Shinra. His head. You're welcome to stay the night if you want. Oh, for your charge? You never know who might be a Shinra collaborator. Watch what you say and who you say it to. And who you beat in Queen's blood. You're welcome to stay the night. Okay, if same you want. conversation. <gasps> a Tomberry. A Tonberry plush. <laughs> what is happening here? What's going on here? I can't even remember the last time you invited uh, me out for lunch like this. I need that Tom Berry plushie. How much do you need? Alright, well, I don't need that. I don't need any plushie, but... Um, 500? 500 for what? But that's all. And then I can get fuzzy wuzzy. What am I going to do with you? He loves collecting the plushies. <laughs> wow, look at the little piece of toast. Is that supposed to be lettuce and then maybe like a pasta? That actually looks really good. Someone's got their eyes on me. Actually seeing people eating in the inn. It looks completely different. The Tom Perry. <laughs> I will never underestimate something again in my life, by the way. No, well, that's not true at all. But what I mean by that is I will never underestimate something because it's cute to not be devious and destructive. Because they are. Okay. Lifeline and peril. I thought you were here to fix them. Never mind. Fix yeah, them. we're more like demolition experts. So unless you want us to blow something up, don't admit that. How can you make jokes at a time like this? It's downright distasteful. Uh, anyway, what's going on? It's the Mako pipeline. It sprung a leak. I paid a wandering merc to patch the thing up. I certainly wasn't about to fiddle with critical infrastructure as a layman. Mm. Though I thought I'd hear back from them by now. Oh, did a they take his money and leave? Yep. Some hot shop from Midgard's Undercity. Oh or no. Sounds like a pro we ought to get to know. Or oh, expose. Like well, if you're that keen, would you mind delivering a message for me while you're at it? Inquire about the pipeline. It's your standard Mako pipeline, really. Carries a portion of Midgard's yield straight to us. We'd be lost without it. Oh, so the in between. Hence my anxiety. We need it fixed ASAP. Our tanks got some left, but we'll soon be running on fumes. Makes me sick to my stomach to watch our supplies slowly dwindle like this. That's mm. rough, man. But hey, good opportunity to wean yourselves off that poison. <laughs> okay, now that one was funny. <sighs> our town technicians laid up in bed at the moment, recovering from a fiend attack. We asked Shinra to send someone to fill in. Anyone who knows the work. Okay, so it was Shinra back. sent. Fortunately for us, that mercenary rolled into town. Without him, we would have been up a creek. All right, we're going to take it just because I'm curious. Well, capital. We would take it anyway, oh, but I'm I extra curious about who this Merc is. I'm Fritz Bellinger, the mayor here. Oh. I'm sure that mercenary is hard at work Fritz. over at the warehouse outside of town. 
mind asking them to give us an update on the repairs. A simple, it's coming along, would suffice. Yeah, people are probably getting a little we antsy about that. Oh, let's see if he has anything extra. Uh, I'm losing sleep at the thought of our Mako supply running out. What so you don't would we do without it? About? I understand the company has their hands full right now. That Midgar's their top priority, but I hope they haven't forgotten about us. Hmm. <sighs> Something tells me they haven't, but I also feel like I don't trust this Merc. A cat! I finally went and got myself a cat! It's actually kind of nice to know that I can come back here now and I've explored as much as possible. There's still new things, but... <gasps> a rare card lost! <gasps> okay, wait, there's somebody... Oh, oh my goodness. Livestock's Bane. Bartender with a losing streak, calm, the rusty arrow, got beat bad at Queen's Blood. But the real stinger was that I had to give up my card. I'd staked on the match, a rare card I'd staked on the match. I'm looking for a pro to win it back on my behalf. Done. Done. Next question. Give me more. <laughs> Hero for hire. That's the lifeline for the mayor. Oh, so you can start them either by naturally finding them in the wild, naturally finding them out, or if you run into them. Nature-loving farmer Grasslands Oliver's Farm. A clever fiend of some sorts has been preying on my livestock as of late. And if I can't put a stop to it, my farm's doomed, I tell you. Doomed. Seems clear a run-of-the-mill hunter won't cut it. So, I'm in the market for a merc. I like that we can accept as many as possible, but... The most important mission. The bartender's request. Alright, we're tracking mission. Side hustle complete because of the discovery. Here we go. I, I need to. I need another hit. I gotta play some more Queen's Blood. Hey, how you doing? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, Mister. You a winner? Some say. Oh, some say. That's good enough for me. The name's Vash, and I could really use your help. Gosh, they always do such a clean job of shaving. Hard. So, not only did my ego take a licking, but I lost a card near and dear to my heart. I know that too much. What I'm getting at is, I think you'd be able to win it back for me. What card? The Chocobo and Moogle one. It's rare. We don't have... one high-value card in my whole deck. It was the only thing getting me through the daily grind. Oh. I mean, the bullshit I have to put up with at this job. The fights, the late nights, the drunks. The drunks yeah. And that slimy bastard. Do you think it's crying, Ned? Hey, I get it. I'm a bartender, too. That's an understatement of the century. You are? So then you know. She's so tough. It can be. Get it back yourself. Oh, thank you. Thank you. But first, I gotta make sure I'm putting my baby's fate in the right hands. Mind if we go around? <laughs> I'd be insulted if you didn't want to test my skills. Next question. I got it. We got it. Um, I think I'm pretty happy with what I have. I did, I did get a couple things in my deck, didn't I? Let me go back to editing. Ah, I did get the screamer. All right, let's throw that in there. Oh, no, we're not happy with it. You know why? Because we got to remove some of these twosomes. Yep, I'm deleting the the rat. Wait, hold on. Okay, I want to remove the Mew's good. I like the Mew. I don't think I love that one. That's what we're going to get rid of. We're going to get rid of the... I have two Zuzus. I'm going to get rid of a Zoo and get rid of one of these. And then I need to add two more ones. Yeah, I need to add some solid ones. This one, for example, the Cactuar. Cactuar is a good one. And we need one more card. Let's do another security officer. I think they're strong. Let's do it. Wait, I have two cactuars in there. No, that's fine. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Select the cards you wish to mulligan. Two security officers. I'm actually going to take that. I think this is a deep in the hand. The only thing I'd get rid of is maybe the... Maybe the levercon. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of the levercon. 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 Oh, I can't talk. All right, Zuzu. Let's start by security officing these first two spots. Mm. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna do this. It's strategic. Just hold on. Ah, a wolf. Okay. Ooh, the vole rat. It's like a toxirac, but I'm always gonna call it the vole rat. The mole rat. 
that does something to that card. When played, lower the power of the allied card. Wait, of the allied and enemy cards affected on three tiles. Okay. No, let's go this. Mm -hmm. mm. I want a hard push. But do I want to do that there? Or do I want to put a three there? Let's go here. Do, 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 do. Ah, he's meeting us with a... Okay. Let's go ahead and do... Oh, that's a good play. Although it's going to give that bottom row, but I could toss the bottom row. Win the two middle, top row and bottom row. Win top row, bottom row, let him have bot... Top row, middle row. Let him have bottom. Yeah, he's going bottom. That's fine. That's fine. Let's keep pushing and take his entire top row. I only have one card, though. That will give me a strong card there. Confirmed win. <gasps> that will literally... It, it, he can't place anything. He cannot place... Well, he can place one thing. But it won't do anything for him. Oh my gosh. Oh. You, sir, are completely wasted. Um... What, how do I want to do this? What's the best way to do this? I, I know I've already won, but still. I gotta add a little bit to it, you know? I'm gonna place this here. He can't do anything. It's not enough to just win. Am I going to get karma because of this? Absolutely. Next question. Three. I want a three there, so I need a... I need to fill one of these two cards. The Zuzu. And then we're taking the Screamer, front line. But the Screamer's only worth one point, but now it's worth four. Let's see how much we can win. I need to know by how much. <laughs> uh, wait. A Devil Rider. I have two Devil Riders. Place a four down there. We're actually tied in the middle row, but we'll take it with the... Three. It's just, it, it's not even fun anymore. Hmm. It would make that stronger up top, so I get more points up top. Then we'll do the Mew. No, it doesn't matter. None of them are gonna get bonus points, are they? Wait, the Crystalline Crab does. I think I could get his card back for him. That was excellent. That's why the bees are the... Insect is actually pretty good because if you bum rush one of the tops and then you place it, you can claim the bottom. That was a good one. Uh huh. Okay, that's the kind of skill I'm talking about. Yeah. You'll beat Virgil, no prob. That's the guy you gotta play. The one who took my card. Oh Works no. The clock tower. Mind kicking Virgil. his ass. Virgil. And when you're done, come straight back. I'll have a special cocktail waiting with your name on it. Got this great recipe. I've been itching to try again. I cannot wait to find out what that is. About a match. No, but... So that's nice to know that if we take some missions, sometimes that's how we'll be able to do some more of the cards. Okay, we're headed to Clock Tower. That's the Snaps mission. We can quickly do that and come back. But we are headed to track down... Is it beyond? Oh, it's up and over. Yes, it's on that side. We just have to go up and around. <laughs> when I grow up, I'm, Damn. I'm gonna be a soldier. That's not Virgil. You, ma'am, are not who I'm looking for, but I'm gonna go up here. I think this is how I could get there. I don't remember the water being that high. No, I think it, I guess it was always that high. That goes back into the bar. We have to go up and around. Sorry, guys. So, what's new with you? Let's go around. Oh, here it is. Need something for the kids? Pass the selfie girl, who is still selfieing. Try to relax and go do, 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 do. Clock tower up at the very top. I think this person's going to be good, though. If they have a super rare card, that means that they are not the best. But also. It's not like the bartender was the best at it either. Virgil? Virgil's down below. Hold on, everybody. 
to the fire escape. Virgil's outside. Oh, I think he's our first level two person. <gasps> he is. Oh, care for a match? We're here for the card you took from the bartender. Ah, the card. So Vash has resorted to this, hiring people to win his games for him. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Fine. But word of warning, I'm not a pushover like some folks. <sighs> okay. But he's willing, honestly, he could have just said no. He didn't have to be willing to fight us back. I'm gonna go with this, I, I, I'm happy with this deck. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, I think that's where, I, I think a lot of you guys have been the ones that have suggested, uh, I'm not, I'm butchering the name of this, but Yakuza Zero, because of all the mini games that I've heard from that. Guys, I just think the screamer is a little impractical at times. I'm not saying it's impossible for me to pull off, but I think it'd be a little difficult. I'm gonna get rid of the Toxerat. Still gonna hold out hope that I can do it. Let's go. Let's go here. Keep kind of pressing top row. I'm gonna try a similar strategy. Ah, the Levercon. Ooh, that's good, that's good, that's good. We could go crystalline or mm-hmm. Mm I like that. I like that. I'm going devil row to uh wait, oh. I was gonna go devil rider. Hmm. If I can push these out one more. If I can get an extra one up top with the scared, oh shoot. There's a three, but that would put the screamer in the back. That can push one over there. Mm. I don't wanna waste a two. I definitely should put a two here, but I could put a, I could put this here and then I could put the screamer in the back. The screamer's not gonna do a lot for me though. So that's what I'm saying. The screamer is so hard to pull off. Okay, I'm dropping here. We gotta go to, uh, he's going top row. He's investing in the top, but that's okay. This is the perfect time to, oh shoot. No, 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 cause I can take over his top. Uh, I would take it over, but I think that's not a good use of, I would rather place him here. Hmm. I'll let him have top. He can have top row. He's not gonna take my two guys right there though. No shot. Oh. Okay. I can take his whole bottom row. He's getting four points in the top. I think I should throw the top because he's going to win that regardless. It's really the middle row. Like if you see it, it's the middle row that we're contesting for. And then I can sweep the table with the bottom. But I do have a couple twos. I could just, I could, well, I could match him. I already have. <sighs> do I want to do the Levercon? Then I could do the, I hate the double rider. I actually don't like the double rider. I could do the Toxie rat middle and he'll go top side or he'll go bottom and either way. Wait, I like this. I can, I like this. I can let him win the middle and he'll lose points. I think I like that. If he takes it back. Okay. Okay, I'm losing points on that whatever happens. Right, cause it's a, no, I don't. If he was to have somebody there, I would lose it. Oh, if I take this over, he can't place anything anywhere. Oh, don't mind if I do. Let's see if we can do, I guess that's the best I can do. And a GG, good sir. You might win the top row, but I win the bottom and top. Let's go ahead and place a Zuzu here. Ooh, we can do the screamer in that middle row and then place a twosome to next to it. Finally, I can use the Screamer. I don't know, I, I don't think the Screamer is worth it. I would rather take some more low costing strategic cards. All right, I will win the middle row with this. This is four points. I might as well put up four points here. And do the Cactor. Nine and 
Queen Bee. Queen Bee's worth one point. Levitron is, or Le Levitron, Levercon. And just like that, we win the card back. Not bad. Already won. And then the icing on the cake. I've never taken a full uh, line, though. Like an entire row? What? Ah, damn. Mm -hmm. I really lost? It was one hell of a match, though. Not to Am I right? Oh. You and I are <laughs> I didn't see the... to play again sometime. <sighs> but, uh, not today. Gotta run. I'm sure Hold you it. do. Aren't oh, you're right. <gasps> you're right. You're <laughs> right. Right, the card. The one I won off Bash, right? Oh, shoot. No. Which card was He traded again? it with somebody else. He oh, lost crap. it to somebody else. I remember. The Chocobo and Moogle one. So this is kind of awkward, but oh. I don't have it anymore. Is that so? Oh, no, seriously, I I flipped it. I was on my last gill, so I had to oh. sell it to a card collector. The shop a out guy back. Named Thorin. Yes. He runs this card shop outside of town. This is how we go to Maybe him. Maybe check with him. A merc's job is never done. Am I right? Yes, Tifa. Yes, you are right. Okay, Thorin. Yeah, Thorin. Now we're really going. Uh. Really going Lord of the Rings with this. Um, let me see. I want to get out of here. There we go. All right. We have this already set up, so we can go straight there and finish this. Is that a level three? No, I think he's a level three, guys. Mm, I, I'm sure I'm fine. Level two seemed kind of easy. It's going to come down to luck of the draw. Do, 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 do. Hey there. You folks buying or selling? We're here for the choke It's a card shark. Card. <gasps> Look course, at the cards in the back. I hate to break it to you, but ain't no way I'm giving up that beaut. I have to at put least, something on the line. Not to some dabbler who fancies himself a collector. Unless you more than dabble. <laughs> I'll tell you what. You beat me, oh. my card is all yours. Look, he even has a matching so, apron to the queen's can. blood. A queen's blood apron. Why, only the most popular card game in recent memory. Name comes from that legend of the queen who ruled the world till she was deposed and killed by her people. Oh. And from that royal blood spilt, sprouted the fiends of the world. Come on, you know the story. Of At course, rate, I was testing you. Really taken off. No matter where you go, you'll find people willing to play. Do, do, do. Purchase cards. <gasps> Purchase cards. <laughs> cards, cards. The fat chocobo. Wait. S uh, suppressive strikers? Ruffians? <gasps> How are you sold out of those? All right, we're taking the fat chocobo. Done. And Titan. We can get... I hope somebody recreates these cards. I will buy these on Etsy in a heartbeat. Oh my goodness. I want a deck of these so bad. <laughs> Please. Challenge him to a game. What do you think, level three? Then bust out those cards, boy. <sighs> Can't be too hard. <sighs> All right, the Chocobo and Moogle card is on the is on the um, is on the line. Raise power by one for each other enhanced ally card. Okay, I'm seeing it now. All right, let's edit the deck though. I'm gonna remove. So we're kind of going back here, but we're gonna go ahead and remove the screamer. Fat Chocobo? Three. That's a great three to switch. To the Fat Chocobo is kind of broken. And he's worth five points too. Oh, it's on. It is on. Woo! Do you see how some of them are uh, gold rimmed? That's a rare card because we have, wait, where's uh, Titan? We also have Titan here. There he is. He's only a level two. Okay, let's get rid of something else so we can add him. I'm gonna get rid of the rat because I keep tossing him anyway. Add Titan. Titan is a rare card too. Okay. This, I feel like I'm gonna get absolutely obliterated. <laughs> we'll see. Oh, of course I have Fat Chocobo in the deck. Um, You know what? I'm actually happy with this. I'm good to go. No, get rid of the Devil Rider. 
Devil Rider is like a trade-off. You aren't likely to unlock a lot of spaces with him unless you're going front, like all the way. But you do get four points in a line, so he's not the worst. Let me go. Let's go this way first. Then we're gonna go Mew in the middle. Mew in the middle. That's a great card, great first strategy. You get doubles on both top and bottom. I can't contest that. Oh, I did not place the right card. I am mentally just completely... He just placed the Moogle card. That was actually not bad. He's going Mew topside. He's getting a ton of points there. We can go either the Tron Okay, we either go that or we go Cactar. Cactar 2 there. Devil Rider in the back, no, but we could go J Sweeper. Or do I want to push here? I would I would contest this, block that. Yeah, block that so we can't. He's going to try to take over the bot. Yeah, great. No, great. Great choice. Okay, I'm 100% going to lose bottom row at this rate, I think. So I got to put everything into top and middle row. I can definitely get points there. It's possible he steals that middle from me if he has a card that does diagonals. But we're not out of this yet. I could go security. I could go... Mm. Two, two sweeper. I think I want to go this guy here. Oh, if he goes Mew, though. No, I'm actually, I like this. I think. Oh, an Elephadonk. What did I tell you? Elephadonk. Elephadonk, whatever it is. The Elepha... Elphaba. Okay, now we're going to go J Unit Sweeper here. No, it won't give us the next one. I've messed up. I've seriously messed up, actually. I mean, I won't get a lot of points on the table, but no. It's pretty much the best I can do. I messed up. He's gonna take top row, or he's going bottom. But he just took my diagonal, that little turkey. I can get a ton of points in the middle row, maybe? Oh, he has so many points. Ah, he's gonna, ah, I don't know. I, yeah, there's no way I can get enough points in one row. He passed. He passed? He thinks he has this in the bag enough that he just passed? Well, of course he does. <gasps> the Devil Rider! The Devil Rider! <laughs> the Devil Rider! I just absolutely crapped on him. You passed. You counted your chickens before they hatched, son. And now you're gonna get burned for it. Wait, but we're gonna tie, but it's... Oh, it's gonna eliminate it, but I won by one point. One point! Oh! Woo! Let's go! Oh, I gotta pass. Give me that Chocobo and Moogle. Woo! New card obtained. Chocobo and Moogle. There's no way that he's not going to let us keep it. Skills, son. Surely. For thinking otherwise. Deal's a deal. Here's your card. The card has been added. Go up against me. I'll be bringing my A game. Are you trying to say, oh, the sun was in my eyes. Oh, no. Oh, the hair was in my face. Yeah, all right. I see your collection. I see it. Oh, I'm gonna come back and show you what a real collection looks like when I'm done with this game. I'm gonna put your collection to shame, Thorin. Son of... No. <laughs> okay. We should fast travel to the snap spot. Ding. Fast travel here. I like this rift right now. Wee. <laughs> Let me collect these. Hold on. Whee! How can you not have fun in this world? Like, this is awesome. Alright, let's get a speed boost here. 
Should be going just up this hill. Oh, I think, I think I've been up here before. To the tippy top. Mmm. Oh, look, he even has a lens already up there. Scenic spots. When you stumble upon a particularly scenic spot, press square on the main menu to enter photo mode. Take a picture, capture the majesty on film. All right, once you're satisfied with your shot, speak with snaps again to be rewarded. Oh, wow. I like the little post, the sign. All right. Oh, all right. Main menu, photo mode. Oh, that is what loyalty looks like. Do you see the way that Pico looks at me? Just amazing. Okay, well, this is... I kind of like seeing a little bit, but then I kind of blend in with the background. Ooh, let's change. Okay, angles. Ooh, yeah, let's go out a little bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tilt. Oh, oh, nope, 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 nope. Unless. Oh, I'm just kidding. Hmm. Exposure. Ooh. Bring it down a little bit. Yeah, bring it down a little. Add a filter of some sort. Let's kick it back. Uh... No, it's pretty vibrant. I love just regular guys. I'm not a filter person. Like I could see this, but no, I just, I like their regular. Mm. <gasps> this, we didn't have this frame before. I don't think we had this frame. Camera position. <gasps> oh, okay, wait, wait, go back to this. Nothing. Camera position. Yeah, so how do we want to do this? I would say right here. Like maybe we can move it back. Okay, right there. Cause you can tell he's there. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. All right, snap. I can hide myself. No, I think it's cool that I'm there. Wait, back, back, back. Oh, I can go even further back. That's it. Barrett, um, Barrett. It's just, it's one of those kind of solo shots, you know, and his head's in the shot. And there's a tree right there. Okay, there. Okay, there. How do I take it? Hide menu. There we go. Hide menu and what is snap? What? Oh my goodness. I'm gonna go insane by this. Just trying to figure out how to snap it. There it is. No, there. How do you snap? Did they say how? They had to have said how. Snap it. <laughs> snap it. I'm pressing every button and I'm just... Did I get a photo? Oh no, what does it look like? Main menu photo mode? <laughs> so I guess I got it? I guess when I left the menu, it took the photo. Oh, that could look one of many different ways. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's go back here and run back to snaps. <laughs> mm hmm. Tom is currently on snaps. Alert. I've got your photo. You're not going to love it, but yes. Hey there. Thank you for tracking. A new camera that filter. That's how you get more stuff. You did me a good turn, so I did Grassland you one too. Skies. I convinced the association to make you a member. Of course, you're starting on the mm. bottom rung, but you'll work your way up. And the more locations you find, the faster you'll climb that ladder. Absolutely. Amateur. I'm an amateur. Amateur. Amateur photographer. Oh, yeah, we got to return the card to him. True, true, true. Good point. Okay, we take the card back. I think he's gonna let us keep it though. I think he's gonna be like, oh, you're clearly the best. You'll make more use out of this maybe, or something. Breaking news at this hour. You're Sir? Family. You got my baby back. To be honest, this isn't the first card I've lost. Uh, I'm and not going to get the others. How many I've lost, one this rare is definitely yep. wasted on me. Here, it's probably better off with you. Look at the chocobo drink behind him. Really? 
But only until I've gotten good enough to win it back. <laughs> I will keep That's him to that. My mind. Right, enough of that. How about I fix you two your drinks? So, this guy moved here recently from Midgar, left after the Sector 7 tragedy. Ah. Uh... Anyway, he kept raving about this incredible cocktail served at a famous bar in the Undercity. Seventh Heaven. Seventh Heaven. The name oh. you heard of the joint? <laughs> no. They called it the Cosmo Canyon. Oh my goodness. Hey, Go on. Drink up. How fitting. Thanks. Oh. You know, that was just what I needed. Knew you'd like it. Although apparently my version pales in comparison to the Undercity original. You just don't have that special so touch. So the guy flat out refuses to order it again. A pinch of salt. That'll give it the kick it needs. Trust me. Salt, huh? Hey, that's pretty clever. Really? Is it like a Bloody Mary? Like what's going on here? Wait, salt? Don't tell me. Margarita? You're the one who invented the Cosmo Canyon, aren't you? You're that seventh <laughs> heaven bartender. Not today, but someday soon. When we do open up a new place, swing by. I'll make you a Cosmo Canyon myself. Oh. Okay, but I'm holding you to that. I'll be there opening night with bells on. Promise. Oh. Entering new markets. Quest complete. A rare card lost. Uh, let's see what he says. Can't believe it. I met the seventh heaven bartender. Well, people don't know that. With that card. Do they? Okay, I do remember that specifically. I remember if they know. No. That doesn't mean that he knows she's Avalanche. They never. They just. I can't remember if they connected the two, the Seventh Heaven and the bar. Okay, or Seventh Heaven and the Avalanche crew. Uh, so flowers on the hill. I'd like to go do that for our uh, Lady Chloe. Life in peril, and then livestock bane. So, it is time to get boot scooting out here. Let's track this. Oh. Do, do, do. It's only been 10 short years since Calm. Since Calm was rebuilt. 10 years? 10 years since Calm was rebuilt. I have been binging out last trials. So whenever I see Whenever I see posters, I just want to rip them off. I do want to see something real quick. I want to go to inventory. Items. Not the cushion. This. I wanted to see this up close. It looks like a pipe. <laughs> Where is the... Oh, there it is. Okay, I see it. I gotcha. Tracking. Ah... That's so fancy, like very well made. Oh, the crown doodle, Chad model. Module. And the item transmuter. This looks like something out of Bioshock. I love it. It's like if Bioshock met a TI calculator, you know. All right, onward to New Horizons. So we are going to go swoop a whoop up here and then bring it down, I suppose. There's a lot of stuff down here, too. There's so many things to explore. But I like the idea of making this episode kind of a explore the lay of the, like, get the lay of the land. The music's so different here. Oh, man. It's entirely different. <laughs> oh, we're sniffing? It's so, uh, there's something about frolicking in, you know, frolicking, I think it's by the bunnies. I think it's in the middle of the bunnies. No, oh, there. Yeah, frolicking in the grasslands feels more magical because it's, there's still like, you can feel the life. Like I know we're seeing these rabbits, but a ruby, it still just feels different. It feels desolate, just sad. It's like you can feel the earth crying out. Smack him up. Let's go ahead and do Unbridled. We need to get Tifa, or Aerith, actually. Don't mind me. We need to get Aerith to do a 
Chrono each. Come on, I dare you. And then we'll shift somewhere else. And we're gonna get her to cast a another chrono. See you around. Oh. Okay. That was fast. Mm. So magical. Oh. It feels like when <laughs> it's like when the spell gets lifted from Beauty and the Beast's castle. <laughs> That's how I see it. Activation Intel 5, Calm Outskirts Tower completed. We're actually getting a lot of that area done. We're over halfway. See what's at the top of this. This should be relatively easy though, because I think we're gonna see any of the things that we can actually interact with here, just because there's not a lot of vegetation covering anything up and we've got the roads right there and outside of that. Is that another tower on the other side there? Is that? Is that that? I think it is. I think a lot of it just, when you're here, it looks so much, I, I think it's like we need a warning that things on the map may appear further than they are. You know? <laughs> This music somehow feels like Final Fantasy smashed with James Bond or something. Let's actually completely explore this too. Swoop around here. What's at the top of this? Can our chocobos climb? No. Is that a, is it because there's an emphasis on like a electric guitar of some sort? Oh man. Okay, let's go down here. <laughs> okay, let's run to the other side. Oh, that's a lot. That actually is a lot. I can see how, okay. That's really not that much. I mean, it's a lot, but we'll prioritize that. And then we'll go further out. Yeah, this, we can clean this up nice and easy. Let me see our transmuter, by the way. We might find different materials over here. Oh, missed, yeah. We can do something here. Oh, wait, the windmill gear. Oh, I do want to find what that mission is for. Yes. Yes. Okay, we can't craft anything. And then let's just see our equipment right now. Okay, Aerith needs to cast like one or two more times. Hopefully we find another weapon for one of them. Wait, 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 let's see. Any new items? Sprig and also Mar uh, Marjor. Mm. Any items up here? Get a little exploration. The only thing, maybe I need to change my POV because I just feel like every time I look down, I'm getting chocobo butt in my face. Just because of the others that are with me right now. Alright, let's... Oh, the hideout's right there. We could keep doing theirs. Yeah, let's go get close to that. Mm-hmm. We're taking it back. It's a warehouse now. They upgraded to a full-blown warehouse. This takes us down and up. This is how we get up here to begin with. I'm going this way. I'm going this way first. Oh! A rest stop! Your chocobo doesn't sense anything near. Yeah, yeah, I'm following, I'm following. Wait, now, wait. Hold on, mini baby chocobo. Wait, 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 wait. It's this way. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There it is. By the rabbits. It's always near the rabbits. Not always, but... Oh, come on. There you go. Gil? Three high potions. Okay, there's the baby. We're following you, baby. Abandoned Republic factory area of interest. Oh, well, we just kind of started it. Oh, I see it. Okay, let's prop up another one. Bring it on up. 
Okay, just now. Oi! Oi! another feather. I love it. Let's go grab this. And let's go to the factory. Oh, I should have pet him. I wonder where their fourth area is going to be because aren't there four pieces to the proto relic? Okay, guys. Investigate the area. So we're looking for a way in, I'm assuming. Oh. Let anyone get their grubby hands on. We're back. Don't they want to know how we keep finding them? They should just ditch the proto. Hey, Clearly we're tracking. We're slowly oh, oh we're slowly oh, whittling man, them down. Save everyone the trouble and hand it over. Not the trouble, anything but that. Just do what he says, boss. Anything but the trouble. I'm still got a trick up my sleeve. A trick I like to call diversionary tactics. <laughs> okay, you know what to do. Okay? <laughs> I bet you couldn't guess who's got it, even if you tried. Oh. It's on him. He's glowing. I, uh, I, you see, <laughs> the correct answer is no. Oh, that's cheating. Uh, me, me, me. Wait, no, yeah, I got it. Yeah. Tactics got him totally diversion. So, uh, what do we do now, boss? Isn't it obvious? Oh, did he trade it? He did move it. Oh, he did. What about the key? Yo, yo, yo. What time is it? Showtime. Don't even get near me. Mm hmm. Let's go and bridal focus. Oh my gosh, why did my Amy not? Uppercut him. And then let's go Aerith. Ward shift? I love this ward shift. Yeah, I gotta start using ward shift more. I want them to get away. Hey. That's the plan. Once they lead us to their hideout, then we hit them. I'm sorry to have ever doubted you. Before you resume your hunt, however, I'll need you to unearth the key they bury. It shouldn't be too tough if you have a chocobo. <laughs> so they have the key somewhere? Oh. We just saw it. Uh, when it uh, appears above it, it detected a scent that warrants investigation. So same, same. Yay! I think we know exactly where it is. I love the <laughs> sniffing, it's sniffing. Oh wait, it wants behind. Ah, clever Pico. Oh, come on, that's like on the same spot. Oh, stop, don't be dramatic. Oh. Turn your beak a little. Oh gosh, back it up. Oh my god. No, is it not here? Oh, okay, so she's saying it's somewhere else. Okay, so sometimes she sm- Oh. Wait, this is different. Maybe she smelled where it used to be? Because now she's taking us all the way around here. No, where was it? Where was it? Get it back, get it back, get it back, get it back. There we go. Oh, the scent is traveling. Oh, oh man. You think right here? Vex badass's hideout. Looks like you found the key. So we have Great. one more to go to. And in other news, the bandits have stopped running. Let's hope that the fourth time will be the proverbial charm. Uh, I think the fourth time will be it. I do. I have, I have a lot of faith in this. Phenomenon Intel Four. Okay, okay, yeah. So, 
I don't even know how we would... Oh! But I don't know how you would access that. Huh. We'll have to look into that. In the meantime, let's go grab those flowers on a hill. And if, uh, if these flowers look like all the other flowers in this area, we're going to have words. This girl and I. We're going to have some serious words here. Okay, we need to go under the pass over here. Yeah. Bex badasses. Onward, full speed. Oh, shoot! Oh, Aerith! Aerith hit a rock. Oh, another baby! Wait, there were items over here. Oh my gosh, it was just the... <laughs> I feel bad laughing at that, but we were all full sprinting and her chocobo just slammed into a rock and... <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm evil. Should we rest? I do have enough stuff. I think we should rest. That way we can heal everybody. You know, I just don't see us using a lot of potions at this rate. With how many rests we have and crafting potions and heals and cures and prayers and... I feel like I never used items to begin with in the first part, and now that we have some more stuff, I feel like it's almost more moot. Oh, this is a destroyed... This is the destroyed... Uh, is this... This is something... <sighs> that's the maintenance... Okay, that's the lifeline in peril. This is something else. This is still like a destroyed... I mean, tons of destroyed. What used to be pipelines? Not really. They made it of something different. We saw this a lot in the sectors. Are we on the edge of one of the sectors? Is this... A Wait a minute. I don't know. I don't know what that is, actually. Hmm. But Chocobo's not smelling anything out. Oh. An ether onion. I don't think we've ever seen the ether onions, have we? This is some good stuff here. Mm. Ether onions. All right, let's slip through here. Oh, nice. Ginger root. Okay, we should be headed to the right hill. I feel like this is going to be a scenic spot, and I almost feel like we should take a picture. Is there anything back there? This rubble. All the rhubarb. Not to be confused with... Okay, nothing done there. Rebar. Rhubarb pie. Rebar pie. These flowers are everywhere, ma'am. Okay, wait, no, those are. <sighs> okay, these guys are not everywhere. Demonic little leaks. Whatever. Let's go. So it's my turn? So it's my turn. Here he comes! One more shot! Are we gonna get a prey going? Well, let's do Kronos one more time. Weapon ability mastered. Then we're gonna go synergy abilities. No. Oh, I can't pray, of course. I gotta cast more. Uh, hold on. Rise and fall. Oh, scream, scream. I'm coming. I'm coming. This one's for you. Let's do pray. Hang back. Don't think you'll walk away from this. Nice. Let's go abilities. Fireballs. Here. Oh, Don't overdo done. it. I got it. Wow. Just look at all of them. Yeah. I've never seen these kinds before. No, I think we have, but maybe not. Okay, I hope not. I hope not. So, know which ones to pick? Yeah. I got this. Oh, I gotta as look at the picture. As much as I want to believe you, your face says otherwise. <sighs> Good thing you've got me here. All so right. So reminds me of when we picked flowers for the leaf house. 
Yes, it does. All right, let's go yellow first. We know we need to pick some yellows. Hmm. I think so. Yeah. Wait, there's multiple kinds. There's daffodils and there's those little guys, like those right there. Hide notes. That doesn't count. What? That's not one. Wait, these, these, these look good. These look good, right? You notes. Yeah, these are one. But I need to pick them. Yeah, I think so. Is it going to tell me exactly where to pick or am I actually picking myself? Because it's not really letting me interact. Whoa, there was. OK, now it is. Oh, my goodness. So cute and soft, too. Oh, I didn't mean to skip her. Oh, no. Pick stalks of yellow. Let me think on it. OK, yes. I'm just going to say yes. I don't think those are it, though. Let me see. Those aren't it. It's the other guys. I got to find the other patches, but that's not one. He's going to say it, too. Start, oh, but we're definitely going to need more. Never mind. I didn't think it was. There's no blue, so we need to go to the red and the white, and then we're done. Tifa's over in that pile. Wait, I have blue in my basket right now. I feel like that's an oversight. Ooh, now these are vibrant. So you like deep, passionate reds, do you? Um, do you remember the evening gown that you were in? Yes, I like deep, passionate reds. Mm-hmm. It is interesting that their their choice to have him not have any like I mean he'd A be in his classic hurt. He'd obviously be in his classic soldier gear, but he is one of the few people that doesn't have a lick of red on him. Wow, these smell heavenly. Definitely the right choice if you want something fragrant. Let me think on it. I guess because you could have gone to the blue and picked some, possibly. Now we can fast travel back, which will be nice. And then we can complete out that quest. And then we can fast travel back to the lowlands. As long as we found everything in this area. All right. That should probably be enough. Let's go get him to Chloe. Oh, she's going to be so happy. Fast travel is now available, and I think we finished most of this. Wildflower Plateau. I didn't really see a lot of other stuff. I mean, we could run to the very top here. Look at it. Yeah. 707. Wow. It looked so small from far away. Naturally, but still. Okay, back to Chloe. And then wait, what's over here? The farmer's request. Oh, let's uh, break it up by going to the farmer's request next. And then we'll come back and fully explore. I want to have the whole left side of the map done too. And then maybe we can go take our chocobos down south. Mm. I feel like I'm getting sick. I can feel it. Feel it in my throat. Oh, is there any new stuff? Wait, no, I don't have anything. I don't have anything, so there would be nothing. But maybe she's selling different stuff? Maybe she sells different stuff after you finish her quest for her. Also, collectible items here. Oh, because they respawn. Sorry. I didn't do it. Look at all of these. Thank you. I'll clean that. It was our pleasure. I'm kind of worried, though. What if mine's not as pretty as mom's? Aw. Well, lucky for you, I just so happen to be a florist. I'd be more than happy to help you. Why am I together. like this? Really? We'll make two. Right, Cloud? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> the game's oh, like, oh, nice. It's just like mom's. But this one's all yours. Yeah, I didn't think I could do it, but I did. I want to see her you give it to Billy. Best. I couldn't have made this without you. Yeah, you could. Telerik scriptures for Aerith. There's something I can <gasps> help you with? Here, oh, Zac really? Efron. Here, for you. Chloe, did you make this? Uh-huh. <laughs> Thanks. Aww. So? 
<laughs> it actually works Cute. perfect on his Don't hat. You think? Yeah. Oh. Cute. <laughs> <laughs> my heart. My heart. Your relationship with Aerith has deepened. <gasps> She's my first smiley face. Honestly, I never want to take it off. Uh, bye. Uh, I don't see anything in particularly new. Hmm. Trade? Oh, Shinra. Hmm. I might come back and get them later. We hope just so I own them again. all. Billy? Do you think Grandpa would like one of my flower crowns too? Yes. Please make one. Please. I appreciate you helping out Chloe. So there also is another part to this. Oh no, right now Aerith's happier with me than Tifa. No. There's another part to this that I really like when it comes to these missions. Again, the coziness. Coziness aside, I guess. Um, Final Fantasy 16 was... It had humor, but it also was very serious. A lot of the missions were sometimes emotionally difficult in other ways, or... Uh, a lot of it showed a lot of the hardships and i'm not saying that there won't be difficult quests to do even that right there there's a tinge of sadness because it's about you know chloe trying to bring back something from their parents that have died so obviously it starts with this sadness but it also is a feel-good quest because you're bringing them a piece of their parents back like the the, the way that it comes across just feels really happy feeling hey, i feel like it's just a little bit more lighthearted. Seeing as you're here, mind help me with something? I'm Oliver, by the way. Owner Oliver. Got fiend trouble. I Every like your flannel. Comes after my livestock. At least I assume a fiend's to blame. Think you could find and deal with it? What do you know about it? Not much, save the bastard's smart as hell. Managed to evade every trap I've set. Even hired a hunter to get rid of it, but that was a bust. Yeah. The ecosystem here is something special, worth protecting. Don't want shit. We're asking him about Broden. And I'm not afraid to say so out loud. One day, some like-minded folks came around. They put me in touch with Broden and Avalanche. Right. Impressive the way that community is able to connect people. Appreciate mm. it. That your dog there? Might have a pet him? Uh, I don't. He, he might. Yeah. <laughs> Who's a good boy? It's you. Red. <laughs> <laughs> Something tells me he's not all bark. Hey, you know, your pup might be able to track the fiend's scent. Oh. Maybe try sniffing around the scene of the crime. Oh, he took out one of the cows. All right, go for a red. Shiver that with all these monsters would be running around if it wasn't for their reactors. The reactors, they bring out Truth the worst. I'm one murdered animal away from losing the whole oh. goddamn fiends. Shimmer never cop to it, but all these monsters would be right. Yeah, we saw that. Okay. Sniff around at the scene of the crime. What do you got, Red? What Here. do you think it is? Trolls? Trolls in the so, dungeon? It's been several days since the attack, so the scent isn't fresh. Other animals have come and gone as well. It's weak. This won't be easy. Hmm. Think a chocobo could handle it? Hmm. Their sense of smell is indeed impressive, but this trail is still quite poor. Though if you wish to try, I won't stop you. <laughs> Alright, we'll have the chocobo. I do want to see something real quick. I think there's a quest with the girl at the windmill. And I want to find out. Pico! Whee! Do, 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 do. Wait, scent, 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 scent. Different scent. Hold on. Hold the phone. This way. We're on to it. The bunnies. It's always near the bunnies. Further proof. This is number three near the bunnies. I'm going to keep track. Five beast bones. This is why it's so important to stop and grab these five beast bones. It's amazing. Full speed ahead. Doom, 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 doom. 
Ma'am? 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 Okay, she doesn't have anything next to her yet. Well, hold on. Sorry. If only there was some way to get it moving again. <sighs> we'll have to come back. This might be something later. Back to the scent of the crime. All right, speed. Woo! Man, they move fast downhill too. All right, Chocobo, let's see. We need to get her to smell it. Oh. I don't like that you have to hold it, though. You have to He's hold what she's got. Oh. What? Do, do, do. Well, I still have a Full speed? Together, we can find the beast. Oh, yeah, together? Don't hop me off. You want to nope. track it from here on out? No, the Chocobo has led us this far after all. Red doesn't have his nose on the line here. I still trust Red's scent. I just think that the Chocobos... No, maybe the Chocobos leading us astray. There was a struggle here not long ago. Huh. Smell it again. Red, can you not provide any better... Okay. I can help guide the bird. Ensure it doesn't stray. Okay. I like that. A joint effort, Chocobo and Red alike. Hmm... Past these guys, ignore them, ignore them. Don't. Shoe fly, don't bother me. Oh. Trolls! They have a cave troll. Is that stop done? Yeah, that stop's done. Oh! Is it down by the Titan Cave? Wait! This is the beach! I've never been here! I don't think we've ever been here. To the beaches! Yes! There's something bad here. Oh, there's the lair. There. What is that? A wolf? It's fluffy and has a tail. Defeat the fiend. What the heck is that? Is that a... Looks like a cotton ball. <laughs> oh, that is not a cotton ball. That is a... That's not a cotton ball. <laughs> it's not any time. So it's my turn? Hmm. That's shot. horrific. Aerith, get him. This one's for you. Okay, let's go. Chrono, let's slow him down. Let's do this. We gotta assess him first, see his weaknesses. There we go. Assess. Immunities. A ferocious grasslands wolf living apart from its known packs in the region. It was once left grievously wounded after losing a battle for dominance, but was able to survive by sheltering at a nearby life spring. It gradually amasses energy over time, dealing damage and blocking it attacks. its attacks will cause it to lose energy. Once all the energy has been depleted, it will become pressured. So we just need to keep the pressure on. Get out, whoa. Keep it together. There. Oh, some kind of howl. Oh, I'll show you that was what not I can good. Do. Oh, not good. Guys, we are down bad. We need Go to get on. a prey going. One get a prey. Shot. Tifa's going down. Come on. Here it comes. Oh, no. Hey, Aerith's going to go down. Hold on. I've got to do cure up on Aerith. Deal with that. Don't give up. Hmm. Do we have any synchronized synergy? Not yet, but close, close. A little bit more and we'll be able to. Okay, let me do a... Here we go, pray. Get back. Keep him pressured. Back away, back away, back away. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh my gosh, I might get clapped here. I might. Okay, we gotta heal, we gotta heal. Hold on, I gotta go high potion. We might actually end up using these after all. Go cloud first. So it's my turn? Go on! Where's Barret? It's your turn! Hang back. Barret! Cure. Cure, Aerith. Keep it together. Try to try to keep her. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. No! Okay. Oh no. No. I'm not blocking any of these. You can do it. Let's do this. Oh, synergy abilities. 
firework blade, but she's down. No, air is good. Eric. <laughs> Try using it. Raising limit levels. Certain synergy abilities can raise a character's limit level, which will in turn unlock more powerful limit break attacks. For example, Cloud can perform cross slash at limit level one and ascension at level two. You can also unlock three. Okay. We're gonna have to reread that. All right, it's time to release a limit, baby. Wait, ascension or cross slash? I'd say ascension. This is Nothing unique. Personal. Break it down. He's totally gonna get pressured here, right? Nice! Nice! Aerith, get in there! Let's finish him with a firebolt blade. Never mind. <laughs> Sorry, Tifa. Yeah, I absolutely got smacked there. I've got a block. What? It's my sense of smell. Since my imprisonment in the Shinra building, it hasn't been the same. Before, Aww. I wouldn't have had any trouble tracking that scent. Now, though... He's losing it. Huh. Perhaps this bird is willing to take on an apprentice. Oh. Oh, poor. I'm going to use Cure so that we can maximize this. Get some points on it. It's going to use up a lot of my MP, but I'm just going to do that. The more we use it, the more we level it up. Okay, we're out. Actually, we're going to go ahead and use an item. We're going to use an... Oh, I don't have a lot of ether. We'll go potion on Tifa. Just in case we encounter anything else. So... Is there anything over here, though? Besides the water. This is all uncovered now. But I don't really see anything. Was there- oh, was there anything in the- the nest? So that beast was traveling that entire distance just to kill some- What was that noise? Are they throwing the barrels? They're so moving the barrels. <laughs> Here we go. Finish out the farmer's task. And then we just have to do the last, the reactor one. And explore the land. So there's kind of a lot to do. You got him, did you? Made that bastard pay. Nice guy. Nice. And I bet you were a big help too, weren't you? <laughs> You'll be singing a different tune when you see what I got for you. Oh. Oh, Fred, brought to his oh, knees by a mutton gears a bit, owl bracer. I heard Brown's not feeling so hot. If you swing by calm again, mind checking on him? Yeah. Your relationship with Red has deepened, so that was a special mission for Red, basically. But Tifa's, we didn't do one with Tifa, I guess. I ask, I know, but you mind checking on him? Tifa was with us for the... Wait, are we sure? No, we did. So I didn't realize that. Yes, when we did the... Okay, so the last one's Barrett's. Yes, because it that that makes so much sense. Tifa's is about the bartending. Eris is about collecting flowers. Red's is about using his sense of smell and hunting. Did you see? Did he just stretch? And then Barrett's is about the planet. Of course, the pipeline. Yeah. Those are so apt. What is this? The businessman's hideout, world intel. I don't know, guys. We have a quite a... Like, this is... Uh, this is a lot of stuff to do. This is at least another... I think this might be another hour. I think that would be another hour. If we're being honest with ourselves. As much as I want to push for it. I think this is already almost three hours. <laughs> I told you guys I'm getting sucked into these sessions. Mm. But just one more. But just one more. Let's go do this, since we're over here anyway. I figure we can complete out all of those for Chad. Oh, oh. For Chadley. And then maybe we'll finish the, oh, 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 the lower section later. My bird's been broke. My bird's broke. All right, speed your little booty up. So we need to, whoa, hold up. We need to grab these items. Uh, I might as well go down this way. Was that a ruby? Ooh, we might be able to transmute something. Mm, 
part of me wants to just, you know what? Caution to the wind. We're just going to complete it. We're going to, well, not that. Wait, what? Oh, through the swamp lands. Uh, uh, guys, we're going to do it. We're going <laughs> to, I'm not rushing. I'm not going to rush it, but I just feel like it will be a lot of fun to kind of do it in one go. Like get all the stuff done for Chadley in this one, this one time. So let me run to the bathroom and then I'll come back and we're just going to do it. Who cares if it's a long video? It's a good video. It's good stuff go happening. And I don't want to split it up. And I also don't want to stop. So we're in <laughs> I'll be back. What do we got here? I got to figure out how I'm going to get across. I feel like you could maybe sneak. Oh, the businessman's hideout. Maybe there. I can see it, but I don't. All right, that's that guy. Go this way. Let me call. Let me call baby. Maybe by the end of this playthrough, I'll actually be able to mimic that sound without <laughs> sounding completely like something else. Whee! It's like a key. <laughs> you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of the turtle. Do you guys remember the turtle with the croc video? <laughs> That's <laughs> totally not the same thing at all. Okay. Mm -hmm. Whee! Nope, nope. Not today, troll. Okay. Maybe. That's where the hideout is. Could you always go this path? <gasps> oh. I never even thought to look over here. Destination reached. Door unlocked. Or maybe it doesn't sound like the turtle, but I sound like the turtle every time I'm making the noise. All right, let's speed through. Da. I know we should probably be attacking some of these things, but I think we'll be fine just by playing the missions themselves. The At one point, it was used for the storage of Shinra property, but the bandits have since turned it into a hideout and probably filled see? it with traps. Yeah, yeah, understatement of the century. Do you see what I see? Okay, we haven't fought. Oh, wait. They're playing dead. I don't get it. Why are we playing dead in the hideout? Obviously, so we can pull one over on the mark, dumbass. Let me just go over here. Well, dead. Try using that brain of yours. Mm. Make a dead guy any deader, right? Wrong. I'm alive! Disfiguring defenseless corpses. You should be ashamed. I should be ashamed. Now listen, what I'm trying to say here is we don't gotta resort to violence. We can talk things out like gentlemen. Got nothing to say to you. Okay, sure. I'll entertain this. We didn't steal nothing this time, I swear. We found it. That is fair. And possession is nine tenths of the law, ain't it? Hmm. That's a good point. No, we did find it. If you want it that badly, we'll sell it to you. What do you say? How much? You wish. Yeah, right. I could get a chocobo for ten grand. No. This is intolerant. Really? Don't uh, say I didn't try to keep it peaceful. <laughs> you guys messed with the wrong legitimate yeah. businessman. Wrong legitimate? Okay, that's not gonna be fun. We need Barrett. We need Barrett. Shoot, can I change the party mid fight? No. Oh, this is gonna be hard. If I'm not gonna be able to use Barrett, we gotta slowly take out some. We need spells, items, synergy abilities. Dive kick on this guy right here. Right here, right here. Butch. Oh, don't go near him. Okay, get Butch, get Butch. Oh gosh, I'm going down. Oh my goodness, we are so low. Oh my goodness. 
All right, let me go items. High potion on Tifa. Staggered. Oh, no. Teach him a lesson, Aerith. Get him. Get him. Let's chrono. Leave it to me. Oh, my goodness. We know what it is, but I might as well assess it anyway. The modded sweeper. Light, yeah. Yeah, an abandoned sweeper that was heavily modified by Beck's badasses. Equipped with an auto repair unit, this autonomous weapon serves as a guard for its bandit's hideout. Exploiting its elemental weakness while pressure it, destroying its arms will prevent it from unleashing certain attacks. Tifa down. No that means, like, I can't. Uh. Go on. Sorry about that. Oh no. Okay, I can stay in here and they should be slowed. Okay, this isn't bad. Let's summon Shiva. I'm gonna do a summon. I've See if we can pull this around. Because I can't resurrect with her. I need to get the rise. Yes, we need to get the rise. Fledgling Summoner. Summons fight alongside you for a brief period and their remaining time is indicated by their gradually decreasing gauge. These beings have a will of their own and engage the enemy as they see fit. However, you can command them to unleash unique attacks by expending your party's members' ATB charges. When the summon gauge is completely depleted, a summon will execute a devastating... Yes. Mm. Summon abilities, I see on Butch. Wait, this guy. I'm I know, I know, I know. Let me get a heal. I need, I can't even care. I've got to go high potion on Aerith. I've got to bring her back from the dead. All right. Oh no. Get him. We got to get that. Okay, let's go. Summon abilities. I see on. Let's go right arm. Someone looks kind of shaky. Oh, ow! She went down. She went down. Oh no. She was going away. Can I pull this? Oh yeah, the kiss. I think. I have to go abilities. I have to go spells, items, high potion, mixed potion. Cloud. All good. Mm. There's not going to be anything that's really great against him. Concentrated fire. I'm going to have to block against him. Let's go abilities. Let's go. Oh, I gotta get a heal going soon. Uh-uh. This reminds me so much of, uh... This reminds me so much of when we were doing the Chadley stuff. I gotta go cure on myself. I gotta go mix potion. I can still maybe do it if I go mix potions, but... I'm gonna have to go high potion after. Punisher. No oh, kill that right arm. Kill the right arm. I gotta have to. Oh, he's staggered. Oh my gosh, he's staggered. Let me do something. Cross slash limit. Go. I should have done it to his body, but that's fine. I shouldn't have won that. <laughs> I should not have won that. Also, as soon as I saw him outside, I should have switched to the one that I bear it. That made me feel like ashamed for that fight. Oh my goodness. All we wanted was to sell the treasure for some cash so we could stop stealing and start fresh. No. <laughs> it's always been our dream to start a company and do all this work. <laughs> hey, we could throw him a bone. 2,000 gil. 2,000 gil? <laughs> could we have done that without fighting? <laughs> Okay, 
I look at this as an investment and what if, just hear me out, there was a quest in Fable 2. When you went, so you could invest in the town before you went to the spire. And if you did, you came back and you earned like twice your profits. So I'm gonna look at this as an investment that they might return. Might not work. Broker an honest <laughs> hey, what is he and hey, no more bandit stuff. I wouldn't call that a. You better believe it. From now on, we're earning our money the honest way. As a business, next yes, business, baby. I cannot wait to see where this goes. Let's talk corporate structure. I'm president, and you're my employees. Employees, employees. Wait, what's a boy do anyway? You work. Be a buddy. Act as family. Work as a servant. Ah, uh, well, I don't feel like corporate is act as a family. Oh. He's not going to know either way. I'm going to go act as family. Oh, family! Oh. <laughs> I always wanted one of those. He's trying to give him a oh Fast and Furious boys. moment, you know? We got work to do. There's huh? glittering riches out there, and your precedent's going to lead you to it. Let's so they're going to go back to yes, finding and selling. Okay, so if you think about it. So you think they've turned over a new leaf? No. Who knows? But they're kind of like people that take the, oh, what are they? Like the um, metal detectors. Look at them as people that take like metal detectors around beaches. You know, they're just treasure hunters. What's the difference between them and like Nathan Drake, you know? <laughs> Founder's bonus. Wait a minute. So one of the arm plates? Qui? Eyes of fire with purpose. Oh, yet a stripling. One whose metal must be tested. No, no, I'm already tested. What? A new person? <gasps> a new person to go up against? In the... It's gotta be a new person to go up oh. against. I have confirmed that you are now in possession of the proto-relic. Proto I've already taken the liberty of scanning it and need only analyze the data. Should I happen to pick up other proto-relic readings, I may request your assistance again. Oh, there is one more thing I should mention. Your device detected a small amount of interference. I can't say for certain but it's entirely possible that others are looking for proto-relics as well. What for? That's what I hope to find out. Great. I'll be in touch if I learn anything new. We're in competition with other people that aren't just the Burke brothers. I've got cat hair all over me again. Grasslands obtained Bex Pro Relic. Proto Relic. Alright, I don't think there's any more items in here. I'm sorry, team. We'll go find a rest stop. Rest stop on me. On me. So this is all done. We want to head down here, but we want to rest up here. Perfect. We will fast travel here. Pop squat with our cushion. Get everybody back to life. Cushion up. I just got lost in thought. All right, world intel activation. Yes, yes, because that will show us all the other things. We haven't done a, I know. Okay, here, come here, come here. You're so good. You and your little acorn butt. Let's go. Yee! Oh no, you've got to be kidding me. Okay, let's go this way. What's oh sniff 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 sniffs. Look for the rabbits. Right here. I'm telling you, it's a proven indication. Yep. Cannot tell me. We'll prove. A couple more tries and it will be. Be a genuine Oh yeah, let's see if we can upgrade anything. I'm on to something. 
Okay, we can't do those. Not that. Nothing. We have to get completely different items. Maybe items that aren't even found in the grasslands. Although, Leah Titanium. Here, activation site. All right, let's pop off real quick. We can't afford to hold it's been a while. Oh. That was close. I gotta get prey up. Ward shift, ward shift. I got this. They just absolutely devour whoever they're on. It's really bothering me. Getting wrecked by it. Okay, I'm bridled strength. Rise and fall, rise and fall. Nice. Omni strike. After shower, get out, get out. I'll show you what I can do. Okay, you ask for it. One more shot. I should have done a pray. Oh, I should have done a pray. We need the materia that starts us with an already like start the round with ATB, you know? Those are the best. I'm also gonna change. Aerith is actually all. Oh, wait then. Aerith is max, so let's actually change it up again. I'm gonna go Barret, Aerith, and Cloud. Yeah, combat settings. I'm not doing too hot right now. Barret, uh, no, Barret, Tifa, and Cloud. Can we just take a moment to appreciate the firefighter poles? That makes a big difference. <laughs> it really does. If you had to climb all the way back down. Hmm. <gasps> okay, we went to that warehouse. We did that stop. What's new? Yes, and we can go on the underpass. Okay, we should prioritize. Activation Intel 6, Wastelands. We're in the Wastelands, which is still a part of the Grasslands, but... Oh, we missed a fiend, by the way. Okay, let's head to here. How do I do this? How do I do this? How do I do this? There we go. I always forget to do that. R3. There should be boxes. <laughs> All right, a new kind of fiend. Although the fiends are my least favorite. Mm. There's something all the way down here. Divine Intel, that'll be fun to get to. Let's go to the, uh, yeah, wait, oh, spring. There's a spring. Owl, wait, owl band. Everything's coming back to me right now. Owl band, yes. Okay, so he gave me. Mm. Oh, it must be a, it's a bangle, yeah. Owl Bracer, 15 and 15. Oh, we can put that on Aerith. Yeah, I think that will work really nicely on Aerith. All right, we'll do the, instead of Enhanced Copper, Owl. I like that. Do mm, Need to go back to using their, exploiting their weaknesses. Spring somewhere up here. The other part that I like, now that we've explored a lot of this area for most of today, is not just... Uh, sometimes it can feel like it's empty, but I actually think I prefer this because what it makes me feel like is, even if I don't get to every single corner, I'm not missing like a hidden box or something. You know, it's not overwhelming to the point that you think you're missing a bunch of things. Oh, here we go. We need to start just being on our chocobo just to collect all of these. The Leah Titanium, I think that was something that is just found in this wasteland. Got it. It's like pie making. Hmm. Five party XP. I think we're gonna hit party level three by the time we complete all of this. Two more life springs. And I think they're in this area too. They should be. Cloud, that data has revealed an intriguing sight. The nest of the Quetzal Quattle, a rare bird native to these lands. We so saw that. Fact that few have ever seen it. This is a prime research opportunity for us. Uh, this is one of the cards. This is a... Combat assignments updated. Leap. 
a lot of combat situations over here. The ones that I told y'all I love. <laughs> um, pin this one. Okay. Let's head on up here. Let's go ahead and call. Hmm. We might want to go divine. No, I say we just scoop up this whole area. This will be, this will be fairly quick. Oi. Printed. This is, yeah, classified foes. Once a specific number of life springs have been surveyed, a location of an especially powerful fiend. Oh no, guys, I don't, oh. No. No. Nope. Nope, we might give it a, we might wait on that one, guys. All right, we might wait on that one. <laughs> We might do that in the the next, the next next. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna hold off on that. We're gonna go, go, go over here. Go over here. The only reason I say that is because I think that's gonna be one hell of a fight, and we're on Operation Cleanup duty right now. So we will hold off and wait for the proper time to strike. But ah, uh, okay, this is gonna be our Mako pipeline. This is Barrett's mission, too. This will be really nice to get done. All right, let's follow this power. Follow this pipeline along. Clear this area. Then we'll end. This is like episode number four, too. We'll end episode number four, having everybody in a happy place with us. Oh, she can't get up. Oh, no, I think I needed to ride across it. Yeah, look, that's a life. Oh, yeah, we got to go there. We got to go back this way. We need to hop up on this, which I don't think this will allow us to. Oh, no. Wait, maybe here? No, it's still a little too. We got to hop on it from all the way back here. It's like the viaduct. There we go. Okay, this should be number five life spring. There it is. There it is. There it is, and I can see it beyond. Just around the river bend. <laughs> Expedition until five. I wonder if we can keep on it too. There might be some things at the very end. All right, we've got sage, ginger root, mellow oak. I don't recognize the mellow oak. They're so cool. Scanning, scanning. Number five, one more, one more. We're making such good progress today. Region Intel too. Our final piece of Region Intel. Yes. Wait, over here. Yes, guys, look. Wait, go back to Intel. Wait. Ah! Wait a minute, I lost it. I lost it? I lost it. Oh man, how did I find it? Was it story? No quest? Intel. It's in Intel. I can't, oh, I gotta do this. Classified wing lacer uh, lacertillion, wait, lacertillion? Laceration almost? Um, hold on. Oh, you can see all the pieces that we have left to do anyway. Oh, okay. That's the, no, 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 that is right. We have to go over here and then it's region until there. There we go. A natural passage through the mountains between Junon and the grasslands. This mine, this is no mine, has long served as a rich source of mithril. I told you guys a mine. The mineral boasts an exquisite shimmer and remarkable strength and was historically used to fashion the very finest weapons and armor, but it fell out of favor after Shinra developed superior synthetic materials. After the mine was closed, the Republic of Junon converted it into a tunnel for the general public, allowing travel to and from the grasslands. The glistening mithril deposits drew regular sightseers as well, following Shinra's triumph over the Republic. However, 
the tunnel has been effectively abandoned. Various sections has fallen into despair, and the depths are host to untold dangers. Danger, Will Robinson. Hmm. Let's see if we can do anything up here. There might be something at the very end. These are exciting discoveries today. Like, super exciting discoveries. Nothing at the end of this? Bummer. Okay, call forth. The eagles! The eagles are coming! I'm just having a lot of Lord of the Rings moments right now. <laughs> when am I not, but... Especially today. Okay, we want to kind of cross this, but is that one of the... Is that the last one? That is a fight. But we're still gonna clear this area. Do 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 do. Bus stop! There should be a baby! Where's our baby? <gasps> Hi! Ding, 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 ding. Uh, yes, you know why? Because rabbits confirmed. Confirmed. Hmm, is it a rule? Not quite. It's always near. I never said it was on them. I just said by them. Gil. Ether onion. What am I supposed to do with all this ether onion? I know, I'm going to, I'm going to, I just want to clear. I'm actually just gonna try to, kind of, oh, sorry, baby. I'm gonna try to run them around to be able to clear up this little, do some chocobo racing real quick. Kind of give them some good discovery. Comb down here. I see, okay, I see the thing, yeah. I can see them. Uh, I know we're gonna go to that stop. Clearing. I wish some of the pockets could be automatically filled. Like if you have a circle almost, it would just, but I get it. You haven't actually explored it, so it makes sense. A little bit further. Plus we might get some really good items too. Wait a minute, that's probably something we're gonna deal with with the mission. Yeah, that looks like a mission centered thing. Okay, so we go down here, and then we comb across and go to that thing. I think that's all of the intel towers. Oh. No, that's the swampy area. That's because that's associated with this one. Yeah, which we're doing all of that later. We're doing wastelands today. In this area, yeah. Okay, down here we should get... We do need to build that bus stop before we fight... Shinra boxes. Little boxes. And wait, we can, uh, we should be able to kick it. Watch out, Tifa. Oh. Uh, there is a... Nose, nose. Bunnies, rabbits, where? There. There. It, it's adding up. Five grenades. And then where's our bus stop? Bus stop is a little bit further up. Hey, hi. All right, take us to to the bus stop. He's so fast. <laughs> He's faster than us if he wants to be. Every time I dismount, I accidentally press to the way that I hop <laughs> off, so it just adds me back on. Easy peasy. Oh, wait, we gotta pet him. Guys, we gotta pet him. There's never, we're never in too much of a rush that we can't take time to give some love to little bitty Chocobo. Do you notice that it's kind of cute when they're a baby? They have the lighter hair, but then at the very tips, it's a little bit more orange-esque. Like a tiny little detail. It's more of an ombre. Mm hmm Here we go. Okay. Picky eater. Better so pressure, stagger, defeat them in the time limit. Ram we can do this. Variant identified. Commencing guidance protocol. 
Can you hear up everybody? Prodigiously powerful appendages. These impressive legs not only allow it to run down prey in the blink of an eye, but also hurl rocks with tremendous force. And if that doesn't scare you, this variant is capable of spewing oh. toxic and transforming Oh, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. All right, we need to pressure focus shot. This is such. Wait, guys, think about this. This is so good. Oh, well, not that bad. Detrimental status toad. I turned into a toad. Are you kidding me? I turned into a toad. Get out of here, Tifa. Get on this one. Ow. Oh my gosh, get me out of here! Right. I'm just constantly Watch being a toad. Fire. He's throwing rocks! Focus shot him! Why am I firing at that one? Cloud, stop being a toad! Stop firing at that one. Oh my goodness, I'm a mess. This is not gonna happen. Omni strike. Hit him in the back side! Okay, we staggered. Now we need to focus strike. Focus, focus up. Focus up. Get him. Get him. Here we go. Let me do a focus shot for the pressure, maybe? No, we didn't get pressure. So we got to pressure this guy. We've got a minute left. We're under pressure. He's charging. Okay, Cloud is back. So focus thrust on him. Keep up the pressure. Keep up the pressure. Focus thrust again. Try this. Yes, yes. <sighs> really? Wait, status ailment. That's the pressure. It's the status ailment. It, uh, wait, let me go to. Oh. Hold on, control. he has pressure, but hold on. Assess him. Yeah. No, don't kill him. Don't kill him. Don't kill him. Fire and ice. <laughs> don't kill him. <sighs> well fought. So perhaps you could polish off those objectives okay. next time? That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Yes, I forgot. Stagger is the focus, but the pressure is uh, what they're susceptible to. That's okay. We can retry real quick. We'll retry. I don't think even. I don't even think I have to kill them. I think I just have to do the one. The one thing. But I did scan them anyway, which I needed to do. We actually need to switch over to. They are fast little guys. Get him! Oh yeah, Tifa's down bad. I just need to. Oh. Everybody's down bad. I should probably heal first, but I need to heal first. But okay, we can heal. Let's just do normal potions. Oh! Let's hit him with a spell blizzard. Watch yourself. Fight Stagger pressure. Nice. There we go. Lovely. Now let's just finish him. Finish him without dying. Cure. Cure on Cloud. After you. Hit it, Barret. Let's do a maximum fury. Dive kick. My turn. My turn. Someone's coming back. Let's hit him with a blizzard. Oh! Thunder him. No. Um. I would say items and just potion and bear it. All right, he's pressured. We're ready to go. We're only number cut. Stagger. And then we do. Ooh, let's watch a synergy. Let's do Relentless Rush. Let's watch it. Congratulations. All intel objectives for this one. For this one. Onward. So we have another fight. We're actually so dang close, guys. We're not doing that fight. Don't look at me. Don't look at me like that. We're not doing that fight. Not in this video. I, I think it would take a little bit more. And also, I want to have more materia and I want to level up and I don't know. I might save them for another day. Save them for a rainy day, you know? 
Okay, we're headed this way. I wonder which divine... Like, which would this be? Because we already saw Titan, right? Yes, this is the way. Mm. Which icon? There's a piece. Hold on. Should show us the way now? According to that the way. Legends, Titan possesses earth shadow. Titan strength. again. He is capable of crushing whole oh. mouth with his fist. Perhaps we have him to thank for the rolling hills and More Titan. plains that comprise this region of the planet. This is all Titans. So will we know when it's a uh, what what was that? Will we know when it's something different then? I guess a different terrain, yeah. Look at this. The yellow just feels like Titan anyway, so maybe the color changes if it's a different icon. <gasps> Attempt to analyze, yeah. We got this. Crystal memory matrix. Oh, it's like an in-between. So between three and six. Between three and six. Do, 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 do. What? Not close enough? How cl oh. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I don't want to tap that. Oh, I pressed X. Oh my goodness, they're gonna get us complicated as doing triangles and X's and yeah. All the buttons. Data on Titan successfully extracted. Woo! Divine Intel. Which means. Which means. That was incredible. It was as if you and the crystal were actually communicating with one another. We were in sync. Some say. Right? And now we just beeline up here, guys. Then we do this side mission. We're leaving this for a liner time. And those are the last of the ones, I think, too. Which we're doing those. Don't worry. We're doing all of... We're going to take the Chocobo back to the swamp. Next episode. Swamp will be next episode. But I'm so happy with everything we kind of put into today's episode. Whee! Anytime I'm doing more side mission focused actions and activities I typically am gonna try to make them a bunnies bunnies a little bit longer episodes mm. kill emerald Ooh, the emeralds are worth a lot that's that was good great find rabbits nothing over here clear this Nose bunnies. I really like this dig system. I love digging though. I just, <laughs> I know it's in a couple games. I love when there's just hidden stuff underneath and a ruby. And we just need to go up. Up from here. We should get on the... Whoa. I don't know if we should go down here. Grasslands Port? <gasps> Whoa. Is this one of the ones that we find? It's a travel point now. The Grasslands Port. To get to Midgar. Find the stuff around it first. I see the material. I see it. I see it. I see it. I see it. Manifestation of the planet's blessing. This port used to be bustling back in the Republic. Wow. Every now and then, some interesting junk floats in from Oh, Midgar, it's so clear. Juno. See, we finally found materia. Item master materia. Okay, let's run over here. Mmm, Tifa. Uh, set materia. Item master. Poison! I forgot about the poison. The poison's unassigned. 
Increases the effectiveness of items used in battle. I like that. I actually, oh, there's, that's the problem with materials. All of them are so damn good. I think I took poison off of him. So I'm going to put poison on Aerith. So whenever she, ooh, I like the poison. Fishing. We used to go fishing here back in my day. This is quite the descent. I mean, this is a whole workout. Thighs would be burning. Whoop, 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 whoop. Made guard checkpoint. We don't need to be here. <laughs> you want to go home and rethink your life. Is it right there? No, it's on the other side of this. Fiend. Oh boy. Pressure stagger defeat. Pressure stagger defeat. Y'all know the drill. You know, I almost want to start to. Oh, we are low health, guys. I I didn't rest. I meant to rest. Yeah, I meant to rest. All right, we're gonna have to pull this together. I need to build up. All right, assess them. See their weakness. Uh, when I scan, when I do these in the future, I'm not going to approach them until she's done talking because I'm missing really good just information and facts about them. Thunderclaws. Rare grassland wolf variants that mutated due to prolonged Mako exposure, likely caused by leaks in the pipeline. Electricity courses through their bodies, allowing them to more to more effectively stun prey. Inflicting detrimental status effects on them will pressure them. All right, uh, detrimental s status effects? Detrimental s Okay, they are great at absorbing high voltage. Get out, get out. It's on you. I know, we're just all getting wrecked. I have no idea how I'm gonna pressure like that. No, we're so gonna die. Let me go. I can't do anything. I'm down. Oh! Bear it! Oh my gosh, we're all... Deal with that. Don't give up. I'm I'll finish it. Oh no, Tifa just got downed. I gotta go bear it. We're not gonna be able to pressure them either way. Oh my goodness, I'm both, we're both down. I needed to go in with full HP. Hold on, can I restart, retry battle? Yeah, I'll lose XP from that. Uh, we need a heal. Hold on. Let's just back away. Caution. Rare grassland okay. wolf variant identified. Commencing guidance protocol. See the way that his mane stands on end? The electricity coursing through his body and mm -hmm. keeping his hair upright is the product of overexposure to Marco. This has also contributed to a significant increase in aggression, agility, and speed. In fact, ah. eyewitnesses report that it is capable of catching prey with lightning quickness. By studying this predator's hunting habits, Perhaps this one? Too will be able to develop Items portion. More efficient ways of felling fiends. Now hurry and collect our data before that nimble wolf gets the best of you. All right. So pressure and... Do I lose the fact that I scanned them at one point in time? Come on! Keep it up! Yeah. <laughs> Overcharging? Let me Bring it. Keep Keeping it. pressure? Now that we're not having to focus all of our attacks on heals, we can do focused things. I got this. Go against the one that Tifa's going on. Hit him around a little bit. We need to go focus the rest. We need to focus him down. High voltage. We gotta get him. He's actually close to being. Oh, she's down. No, he's down. He's down. He's down. I got this. Hmm. I'm gonna have to stay out of it for a second. Oh my gosh. My turn. Oh my goodness. That's the one that's almost done. Let's get a focus thrust on him. This one. He staggered, nice. Oh gosh, hold on. They're not, they're immune against thunder. 
Mm, electric, no, uh, mm, focus shot. That one. Don't stop doing him or down. This. I just don't know how we're gonna get the pressure. <laughs> like, I know what they're saying, but the pressure might, maybe could be brought on by, okay. Let's do a triple slash on him. Keep it together. Right. Overcharge him. The pressure. Gotcha. Let's do chakra. And then once we get this back, we should be able to synergy, which might apply pressure. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. We can synergy? No. We need one more Fatifa. Do we summon a chocobo? Do we summon calls. this? Is that gonna pressure him? I gotta read it again. Deal with that. Yes, it's my turn. Mmm. Chocobo kick. I'm counting okay. on you. Staggered, but not pressured. I'll take that though. I will take that. Next time, see if you can clear all the objectives too. So maybe the clearing the objectives, they're not necessary to get that bonus with Chadley. I think you just have to finish some of it, right? We could come back and do that one second. Cloud! Cloud! I see that you completed that challenge with grace and panache. Don't you know it's rude to interrupt? Oh, Why? you created. No such thing. <sighs> In any case, Cloud, <laughs> I've analyzed the battle data you sent and constructed a new virtual combat trial. Nice. I hope it's to your liking. So, you know what we could do next episode? We could take on the... I, I'm gonna do the pressure another time, but you can see that it's still yellow, so it is showing us that there's a little bit left to do with that. Oh, I forgot about this quest, too. Let's do this quest before we... Let's do this quest. Because it probably won't take very long. It'll be a good one, too. And then we can leave knowing all of our crew is on good standings with us. And we can start, or maybe at some point... We'll come back around and we'll do the challenges of the harder creatures. We can do the. Maybe we'll start next time trying out and testing. The warehouse the mayor was talking about. Yeah, testing our skills in the trials. The look fresh out of Mercs to me. I like the paneling. I know you. I would be you. It would be. Kiri, Kyrie. Cloud? But I was sure this wasn't your turf. Don't tell me. You're the Merc the Mayor hired? There was just something... Kyrie doesn't work. Kyrie, that's right, Kyrie. <laughs> How, what do you know about doing anything on the pipelines, How though? either of you get any work is a mystery to me. <laughs> We're here on behalf of the Mayor. Man wants a progress report. Yes, progress is... Uh -huh. ...what I've been making. Mm. And I'm just dying to tell him all about it, but the thing is... Uh, I haven't actually, like, done anything. I need more parts. <laughs> Wouldn't it be fun if we look for him together? She's who's Sh no. Shinra sent? Oh, I oh, really oh. I a guiding hand from a vet in the industry. Like you. I swear I'll do anything. Anything? Fine. I'll help. If you stop calling oh. yourself a merc. You, sir, have a deal. Okay, so... These are the parts that I need. Obtained a copy of her notes. Or it'd probably be better, but that number there's the bare minimum. So, any questions? Uh, where are the parts? You can probably find them in scrap heaps somewhere nearby. I mean, probably have to use the chocobo to fish them out. He's. Wait, see you soon. I thought you were coming with us. Yeah, we. No, I need to stay here and look for screws and bolts. <sighs> they don't do oh it's okay at least everything's like close by but they don't do her favors by making some of her stuff a little bit more annoying <laughs> she's definitely not one of my favorite characters but i think they kind of intentionally do that at the same time too we're looking for heaps i like her music though this music playing right now is kind of cool corroded nails I think all we have to do is go oh, over here. Let's grab Chocobo. Pico! Ride. But I think this is gonna be a two-parter because I'm pretty sure we saw Mako leaking out of one of the pipes. So I think we're gonna have to do stuff over there. 
straight up. No, is it on it? It might be on it. Is it on the pipe? Okay, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Mm. I think it's up here. No, it's to the right. It's... what? We can't ride our chocobo up there. Okay, let's go grab the other ones. Whatever. Um... Such weird locations. There's also one all the way over here. Let's go furthest. Same that way. The fetch quest. I think the only reason why I just find it to be a little classic. But I think her character's always just pretty on par. Two more corroded nails. Because I feel like this is just, it's classic. Like her somehow taking on quick. more. No, no, no. Oh, no. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. Overkill on the little rat, but that's okay. Just like that, okay? I think it's like the missions are intentionally meant to be a little bit like, come on, how come you can't do this yourself? Although we can see that she apparently watched out for us when Zach was carrying us for the second. There was a little bit of, you know, I don't think that was by choice necessarily, though. She probably left us on the side of the road, too. Oh, we are way too far back. See, this is what I'm trying to figure out. Is it showing right here? Oh, oh my goodness. I blitzed straight past it. <laughs> More corroded nails and a rusted sheet metal. And then the last one is right here. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, we grabbed that. Okay, so just want to make it a point. I think it's up here. Yeah, I see. It. Okay, I think I see it. So I think you follow it along and it's actually right in front of everything. It's actually the closest one. Should be right there. Why do I do this? Why am I like this? Oh my goodness. Barrett's going to be so happy with us though. Did you find what we need? Would I not? Hold on to them for now. Give her everything you collected. Holy mother of scrap metal! Way to go, guys! When we're finished, that pipe will be good as new. A little bit of scrap metal. That we could even charge extra. <laughs> now then, follow me, would you? Let's not keep my money. I mean, the pipe waiting. I know exactly where we're headed. Yeah, it's where we saw the break before. We might have to defend her. Something might come attacking. Dun, dun, dun. Look Rather at the bird. you out here to find me, did she? Because if she did, I'm not going back. Yes. I'm treating me like a little kid, never letting me join her on a job. So I packed up and hit the road. I do like now her grandmother. My her grandmother makes up for her. I can't wait to rub my success in her smug face. Tell him, Merc, defend me. Yep. Oh, fellow Merc. Fellow Merc, by the way. He's digging in. Unbridled strength. All right. Let's focus thrust that guy. He <laughs> just said, get your ass out here. You weren't steel skin. He just said, get your ass out here because it burrowed back. Oh, it's a... Where'd it go? Mmm. Omni strike him. Boom. Okay, shall we? Yes, we shall. How has my cure Let's not been going. leveled up by now? It's amazing. Let's actually see where it's at. Let's go into items. Healing. 227. 
Oh my goodness, that was right. Wasn't this something that I never understood the concept of? I thought if I used it more, it meant that I would get more upgrades and that's not true at all. Let me go into the field menu. Manual. Hold up, in the field. Basics aren't that. Should be battles, materia should be one. No. Equipment and progression. Setting materia, improving materia, here we go. Materia set in your equipment will gain AP with every battle. Once enough AP is accrued, your materia will improve, further enhancing its effects. Okay, yeah, when using magic to adjust the potency of the spell. Right, okay, so it's not by how much you use it, it's just how long it's equipped with you and the XP that you get from the normal fight is what gives, yeah. That was something I constantly did not understand, I think, in part one that y'all kept talking about was I kept thinking the more I used it, the more it would upgrade. Which, like, the more I fight, the more it upgrades, so. Well, here we are. And you're sure that you can fix this? Really, she wants us to do it. You shouldn't underestimate an undercity girl. I can spin garbage into gold. I do believe it. that. Oh snap! The heck is that? Company, stay back. What the hell? Yes, sir. A noxicap? Boom, boom, boom. Let me handle this. Watch yourself. Hang back. <laughs> Okay, we need to. I want to scan this. Whatever we do, I want to scan it. I want that. Let me get that. I got your number. Fire. Fungal creatures that mutated due to Mako exposure. They spew highly poisonous spores to weaken enemies. Then turn said foes into new parasitic hosts. I have the fire, so. Fungal counter. He's spewing, he's spewing. Not good. Oh, nasty. Hmm. I don't have enough MP. He has thunder. I'm just going to use thunder on it, but... <sighs> Let's do a dive kick on him. I don't have enough MP. That was a tough bastard. Mako probably mutated him. Look at Mr. Know-It-All. It doesn't mutate the plants, though? Like the fauna? Mission accomplished. And my reward secure. <laughs> that actually doesn't look bad. Celebrate the birth of our great mercenary union. Forget our deal already. Ooh. <laughs> Come on, fellow Merc. With my brains and your brawn, we could clean up. I'm not your fellow anything. <sighs> Stop being such He's a so sassy. Ass. The point is, I can help you. I can talk you up. Please don't. Like, please do not mention my name ever. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Well, since you're the only Merc in town, guess this one's all hey, yours. Get back here. I deserve that, and that's fair. <laughs> Let me start with Zane. I deserve that, and... Kind of dividing and conquering. You're out. I got this. We need to take a ether. Okay. Mm. Spells. Let's go fire on that one. No, it's on you. Love you there we go. Oh, Keep the pressure. Let's go ahead and hit him with the focus shot. Omni strike. They've got this one going. I need to punish her mode. Yeah. Spells fire. Boom boom boom. How come I don't have to fight those whenever I'm doing the the missions? Those would be so easy. Repairs are done. Let's go see Fritz. Report back to the mayor. I think I could. Can I? Uh, I can't fast travel right to him. I think I can fast travel to the end. No, to the board. Only here. These waypoints. All right. Let's turn in our last mission with Fritz. Get Barrett smiling with us, and then I would dare say that it's a good place to stop. So I think I might start by trying the challenges that Chadley has next episode, and then we'll go into the swamp. There you but are. I can't believe we crushed that much stuff. everything from the Merc herself. She told me how you helped with the pipeline repairs. And sure enough, thanks to you, the Mako is flowing again. 
We're in your debt. I like his outfit. Where's your Merc now? I'm not sure. She left just as soon as I paid. For mm. another job, perhaps. Guess that's what fame buys you. Plenty of work and never enough time in between. Oh, I feel like that is probably Sounds like you very accurate. Competition, Merc. Before you if I had to off, guess. She set this aside for you. Insisted that her fellow Mercs be compensated. Oh, wow. She shared 3,000 gil. Yeah, all I thought about was I was thinking about actors because I was like, I feel like once they're done with one film, before that film even comes out, sometimes they're working on another film or something. It's such a relief to no longer be literally scraping the bottom of the barrel. Maybe Were I'll you? finally get a restful sleep tonight. They're scraping the bottom of the barrel? That's how much that one tiny little puncture hole? I'm surprised more bandits don't try to puncture holes and cause, like, people to have to come out and repair Just and then try to rob them. Just poor town running out of Mako gives me palpitations. <laughs> It's the green blazer. A lot to offer tourists, you know. Our Mako tank, the views from the clock tower, are one of a kind Bailey. Bailey. Our quiet Bailey? town is the perfect getaway for all those looking to escape that urban circus of Midgar. Ever consider moving out here and joining us? Why? I, it's yeah. It's such a relief to no longer be. All right, Maybe same, I'll finally same. Get a restful sleep tonight. Same conversation. So yeah. The actors are terrible for the nearby <sighs> I think this is a good place to stop. I think this is almost like three and a half hours. All right, you guys. So let's end there. We ended up actually completing all four missions in the grasslands. Or there's a fifth one locked to us. Wait, there was a fifth one. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. There's one that popped up when I was gone. What? What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Broden. Wait. Okay, we can't stop. One more. One more. Broden. A good friend of mine's in need of assistance for a repair job, but with my health troubles, I fear I do more harm than good. If you're willing to lend her a hand in my stead, come to see me at the end quickly. Guys, I, I, I <laughs> okay, one more, just one more. One more. It's Broden. We owe him, we owe him so much, guys. We absolutely owe him. Where the wind blows. You're always welcome. We heard that you've been feeling under the weather lately. <laughs> Word gets around fast. Didn't expect you to worry about me. Mm. But since you're here, can I ask you a favor? A friend of mine wanted me to help her fix one of the old Republic windows. Yes! Yes! I meant no condition. I to knew do that, that was going to be a mission. Do you think you could instead? Absolutely. I think we should help. If not for him. We'd probably be back in Hojo's lab. Yes. You don't look so good, though, but... You know, headaches and dizziness. Probably my misspent youth. <sighs> Paying the price for it now. Hindsight's 2020. This is your daily message? Take care of yourself? Anything else? Sometimes Have you hydrated? <laughs> voices, I guess. I mean... Calling for me. Urging me to go somewhere. Sounds pretty crazy, saying it aloud. Voices? How involved with Shinra were you? I was a company grunt years ago. But when my parents died, I got out to take care of the family business. Been running the place ever since. You think just working where he was, like, poisoned him? Maybe he was working with stuff that... Yeah. I'll spare you the grisly details and just say they stole my life from me, Ugh. my family, my home. Because he tried Is to leave? Reason enough for you. But I thought Calm was your home. Not oh. anymore. This isn't the Calm I grew up in. My Calm was destroyed by Shinra. And this was rebuilt yes. ten years ago. A soulless imitation. But Interesting. Because I won't let myself forget what those bastards took. <sighs> Living in hate can poison a man. Mm. There's actually some really good wisdom in this game as well. Yeah, I was wondering when we picked up on earlier that Calm was rebuilt ten years ago. Shinra must have leveled it or something. I was wondering if they. Thank you. My friend's name is Mildred. You should be able to find her somewhere around the old settlement. Out on the cliffside. Look for the windmills. Hmm. I had wondered if they had retaliated because he decided to leave Shinra. Sorry to put you to the trouble. Just to reiterate, my friend's name is Mildred. 
hard. She's an odd duck, but a true sweetheart. <laughs> Aren't we all? I'll go ahead and tell her that it helps on the way. Thanks again for doing this. Sorry to put you to the trouble. Just to Okay. Same, same. Yes. I'm so happy we're doing this. I just don't think I have the parts to make. Read your map. Uh, we have a fast travel as well. And this is why you explore everything. Because when you get sad missions, then you just fast travel back to them. Barely any wasted time. Well, it's never wasted time, but you know what I mean. Mildred. Did Broden send you? I'm glad for the company. Ain't she a sight to behold? A relic mm. of the Republic of Junon. Shinra can't make them like this, let me tell you. I'm itching to scrape the rust off. Get they would never make again. the brick. The Easier laid brick on it? Done, unfortunately. The rotor's missing a key component. One that's a bitch to find. Which is where <laughs> you come in. I'm gonna need your help to get me that part. So, what do you want to know? Actually, yeah, let's ask about Broden. We go way back. Like, way back. The two of us skipped town when we were young, you know? Thought we'd experience what the world had to offer. Aww. Eventually, we went our separate ways. He joined the military, and I became an engineer. How to obtain the part? What happened between Broden and Shinra? I'm, I'm digging, but I need to know. Well, turned out he was a natural-born trooper. Was even handpicked to take part in a super secret experiment. It wasn't long after that we lost contact. By the time we reconnected, he had already put that life behind him. Hmm. What experiment? I have to ask him, though I doubt he'd tell you. Some kind of experiment, Certainly Mako, won't tell probably. Me, at any rate, <sighs> whatever they did to him, though, has something to do with his condition. I just know it. Yeah. If Broden will get better. He's been oh, to I don't doctor want to think about that. Doctor, but all the tests come back inconclusive. So I'm digging through old Republic archives, looking for something that might oh, help. Oh, she's something trying the to help. Might overlook. Just hope I find what he needs soon. Okay. Step one was scoring a transmuter chip, which you did. Which we got from so Broden. We put that baby to work. As for the ingredients, you'll need to bag the Quetzal bottle, this rare bird to get what you need. Not that anyone's seen it lately. Sure Shinra's to blame for that too. But maybe you'll have better luck. Time to tap into some life springs. Yeah. Okay. Not through any shop, that's for sure. It's out of production, <laughs> so you'll have to make it yourself. Yep. So first thing Oh, I first, know. The transmuter chip. <laughs> Once you got that squared away. Okay, we we know. Well, I know what to Wind do now. Counting on you, friend. Well, buckle up. We got another 10 minutes in this. We got another. We got to keep going. Dems to rules. Y'all know. I can't leave this quest unturned. I will complete every side mission in this area. Plus, this gives me a good reason to stop avoiding. I'm avoiding. I'm avoiding. Is everything healed? No. Actually, let's do this. Let's fast travel to our stop. Bench stop first. Rest. That way we don't waste anything else. We need to seriously think about who we want to take with us on this. Do no 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 no. Is that the only thing that we'll need though? Should be. Item transmuter. Know exactly what she wants. Limbal gear. That's all we're waiting for. Let's crush this bird. Gonna like life spring. <sighs> Barrett, or do we go for Aerith and heal? Actually, Aerith has been feeling strong lately, guys. I think I misjudged her. Well, I'm always underestimating all of them. Um This might be a mistake, but I'm going to... Do we need thunder? Cloud has the both fire and ice. What does Tifa have? Tifa has ice. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm actually going to swap out. I don't know if this is a good choice, but combat settings swap. I'm going to swap Tifa for Aerith. 
We'll bring red back in the picture, don't you worry. Ding, ding, ding. All right, winged lacertillion. A lacertillion. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Am I supposed to do something? Oh, once a specific number of life strings have been surveyed, the location... Hold to lure it out. Upon arrival, hold to... Oh... Oh... Oh no! I also didn't use the right setting. I still have this dude. Let's get prayer ready on call. Charge! Oh shoot. Let's do this. Alright, let's here we go, assess. That's too right. The something coddle. <laughs> a great aerial creature that calls the grasslands home. This particular species has existed since antiquity, its genetic structure remaining largely unchanged to this day. It commands lightning, driving away any who dare to enter its territory. Inflicting enough damage by exploiting the elemental weakness. Fire, ice. It's a good thing we still have Diva. Each time it moves between the air and the ground, it will unleash a powerful attack. That is not good. I don't have... No, I took Tifa off. Of course. Electrify. He's electrifying spells. I can't thunder. Nothing's gonna... Yeah. Here goes. Mm. I'm gonna do a chrono. This will slow his roll. Slowing roll, slowing roll. Get our health items back. This one's for you. Oh no, Bubby. Okay, let's do a prayer. It's your turn. My turn. <laughs> <laughs> Chill. Pray? No, for you. I don't know what. Oh, it's going in on her. Just know I'm cheering for you. Are you? Spells. Blizzard. Calling ice. That's it. Pressure. Keep it up. Punisher. 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 Staggered. Operator mode. Punisher mode. Punisher mode. Punisher mode. Punisher mode. All right, we gotta do, oh, synergy abilities, firework blade, go. Go. They're working that together, overcharge it, drop it. Massive damage. Not thunder, not thunder. Let's go focus shot while it's still. Beautiful. Okay. Let's do this. Hmm. Abilities. Snow flurry. Summon's almost ready. Go on. All right, let's go. Spells, Blizzard. Chill. Don't overdo it. Yes, it's my turn. Mm. Okay, I need to get her me. to be able to heal us here soon. Vortex sweep. Guys, I think we got this. I think we can do this. All right, let's get a heal going. He's charging. Hold, hold on. Let him charge me. Let him charge me. Can you take over? My turn. Smack him a little bit. Summon, summon. No, don't, not him, not him, not him, not him, not him. Aerith, summon. Shiva. Yeah, that will do good. Bring the ice Sorry. queen in. I know it's sudden. I know it's sudden. Let's go. Okay, now we need to switch to. Wow. I almost feel sorry for that. Icicle impact. I'll show you what I can do. That's it. Electrify, get out, get out. She's freezing him. He's taking to the sky. No, he's not. No, he's not. Pullman. Dodge them. Nice. Get a prey going. You got this under control. Mmm. Summon ability is a heavenly strike. Deal with that. Watch and learn. Boom, 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 boom. All right. I'll take care of them. Keep getting this back so we can heal if need be. Now you're in for it. One more Word shot. Shift. Good morning. Oh. Come on, get it back. 
Shiva, do some powerful damage. He's coming over to us. Let's do a summon ability, do another heavenly strike, because she's gonna leave soon. Oh gosh. Headlong charge. Oof. Here we go. Do another summon. Heavenly strike again. I'm coming. I'm coming. Ward shift. He's pressured. Finish this. Finish him. Limit. Wait. Cross slash. Go. Boom, boom, boom. Woo! First go. Did I block a single thing? No. Combat assignments updated. Confirmed. I'm Castle coming. Castle Guadal defeated. Amazing work as always, Cloud. Your heroic victory over that vicious creature was a feast for the eyes. I suppose it falls to me to make Mai's presence more tolerable. How are you? <gasps> Volume levels decreasing. Wait. Huh. Now then, allow me to congratulate you on your <laughs> victory over that beast. And thank you for the valuable biological data. You should now be able to craft the requisite part for the windmill. No doubt Mildred is impatiently awaiting its delivery. Okay, well, you know what? Impatiently is not an option when you're asking somebody to not only find a beast that nobody has seen in forever, but to kill it. This is not a fast task. The entitlement, I swear. Uh, I love how Chadley created her and now he's getting annoyed with his own creation. Oh. There we go. Windmill gear, done. And none of the other ones I can unlock. It's good to know that I still haven't lost my ability to do callouts while I'm playing. <laughs> Making callouts like I'm playing COD these days. Mildred here. I think we have to go back to Broden probably to tell her. Yeah. Now that is a quality design. No Shinra knockoffs can compare to Republic ingenuity. Okay, time to see if she works. Go plug her in. This is my, oh, Red's gonna be double happy because now we'll have done two Red missions. <laughs> Hot damn, look Aww. at that. <gasps> and Materia dropped out. It's amazing, incredible. Wow. The blades are spinning! Actually yeah. spinning! What a sight! Oh, I the Republic made find out how things look so different. I wish Broden was here for this. He'd have loved to see these windmills rolling again. Maybe one day. Well, anyway, thank you. You've helped me fulfill a dream of mine. Guess you're heading back to Calm? What's the plan? Aww. When you see Broden, you tell him, hurry up and get better, would ya? We got a whole wide world to see. Or something along those lines. <gasps> we'll report back to Broden. What is this? Orb of cleansing. The cleansing. Very nice. Mm, that should save me from being a toad again, right? <laughs> Isn't that what I used to get rid of the toad? Broden. The end should be... Up and to the side. Broden. Excuse me? Sorry. Not my chair, not my problem. So. <laughs> if Mildred's happy, I'm happy. She said you've got a world. If she's a bird, see. I'm a bird. <laughs> she just wants an excuse to travel. But I am overdue for a vacation. He should go Think out to I've the been seaside. Working myself too hard lately. Rest would do you good. What is this terrible scent? It's reminiscent of Hojo's lab. On him. It's time. Time to go. No. To leave. Hojo experimented on him. He was maybe one of maybe one of He took volunteers. Maybe he took human okay. volunteers. It's just the degradation. Every soldier's gotta make their peace with it. Now you know why I can't see any. Oh my doctor. gosh. You're a soldier too. Aren't you? Ex soldier, <gasps> actually. Didn't mean to scare you. The symptoms aren't always the same. He used to be and who knows? 
You might be one of the lucky ones. Is that why their eyes are the same? Because they've gone through the same. Don't take your youth for granted. All right. You only get one shot at life, and you can't let Shinra take it from you. Mm. You can't let them win. Mm. That's why. Remember when I said I was like, wow, they have similar eyes. I forgot why clouds. Oh. Need to rest. Get my strength. An ex-soldier. So I can see Mildred's windmills. Responsible for the bombings in Midgar. I'd heard the rumors about cellular degradation, but didn't believe them. Didn't want to. Didn't no. Want to believe them. No. I had no choice. People love to spread rumors about soldiers. Mm. Don't you pay them any mind? What a way to say thank you for everything that soldiers do as well. I left the service to keep this place and my parents' memory alive. I'll be damned if I lose it too because of this illness. That was one of his scenes. Need to rest. Get my strength up. Aww. So I can see I really hope else. that comes full circle and he does get to be I out there by the her. So Alright, there we go. Breaking news at this hour. Avalon, the anti Shinra terrorist group responsible to believe to be taken shelter. All right, guys, I think after that, I think this is a good place to stop. We're sitting at 14 hours in. We just completed the wastelands and the grasslands. Not entirely. We still have. All right, we finished all of these. We finished all of grassland stories. We have the map, which is pretty nice looking. Pretty, pretty good. Uh, we've got Intel. So Expedition Intel 3, these final ones, this is in the swamp. I think all the final ones are in the swamp. The Fiend Intel, the Divine Intel. Yeah. And then we'll be done with all of the grasslands. Whoa. So we're headed that way next episode. With that, guys, I'm going to do a little bit of a whoa. OK, that's the last one. Um, also, summon entities. We have all the region stuff and the materia. Yes. Alrighty. No, this is a great place to stop. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. There wasn't a lot of story progression. I mean, I say that, but to be honest, at the same time, this is why doing the side missions can be incredibly important to just building the world and also building the story. No, we didn't have like immediate progression uh, specifically, but even just doing things for Chadley, finding out about Broden, finding out about the people, like helping each of these people as we go, it all adds to the overall emotional connection that I think you form with the game and therefore with the story. A lot of times the story is huge. Story is huge to me. It's why I pretty much will fall in love with anything that is narrative driven, but when you dive into the reading materials, take on the side missions, take on exploration, mini games, all of these pieces just to strengthen your, I think, enjoyment, but your bond to the game as well. It's why I've always, I mean, there's been some games that I've played that have been more linear just by nature, but especially now more than ever, you're not going to see me play games and just go through the main story. I might miss stuff because I'm human and I, I don't try to look up anything. I really don't on playthroughs. So you're going to see a lot of human error because I don't look up at anything. But you're also just going to see a lot of, I don't know, just pure love for a game on, I, I don't want to say on bias because that's not true. I talk about this a lot, especially with stories. I'm going to be more emotionally drawn because of things that I've experienced in my life or core values that I hold or how family oriented I am. Those missions are always going to impact me more. But there's something truly special about that first organic playthrough where it is impacted by as little as possible. Outside of y'all's comments, because I do like to look at your comments and see all the tidbits and advice and uh, tips and tricks, it really does help me enjoy the game more. It takes me a little bit. I do want to remind you guys, especially now, I took three days and basically just binged this game. As you can tell from this video, that is like five, four, no, three. I think it's like three and a half hours, maybe four hours. Uh, I've binged the heck out of this game the couple days that it's been out. And so I'm pretty far ahead of you guys. I would say I'm probably five to six videos ahead of you guys. So if y'all are giving any tips or tricks, don't expect immediate change from me because I just I've already done future chapters, right? So 
I want to say that though, but I don't want you guys to, I don't want that to limit you guys from feeling that you can share any tips and tricks because I can always implement it later. It's never too late to learn, but I am trying my hardest to take on going back into the manual and testing different characters, testing different strategies and ways and taking on all of it. It's, it's helping like kind of warm back up those muscles because it has been, I think six months since I last played or seven months, which is an eternity for me. <laughs> it's an eternity for my goldfish brain, but thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed this special long chapter. Don't expect it all the time. I just couldn't put it down for whatever reason. <laughs> no, there's not whatever reason. Uh, this is a work of art and it commands my respect. So I'm going to take all the time and there's probably going to be some more long ones in here, to be honest, but Thank you guys for tuning in. We will pick back up with the swamps, the swamp. And also I want to take on Titan and those challenges with Chadley. I want to do that too. So that's where we'll start next time. And until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye YouTube. It takes two to make a thing go right.